What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Coming back into Elden Ring. Of course we are. Why wouldn't we be? Don't be silly. What else would we be doing with our time? Get in here. Generally speaking, not entirely sure what else we have left to do that we actually can do currently without having to grind for a lot of levels. We can uh, we can wander around, see what's up. See what's up. Carry a manor, by the way, in case you forgot, uh, we just killed another boss. <laughs> of course we did. Why wouldn't we have killed another boss? Don't be silly. So last time we played, we killed Loretta the Knight. And uh, that's kind of just where we are now. I don't exactly know what to do from here. Thought maybe there was something to do up here with the statue, but it doesn't appear to be the case. So, uh, yeah. Not entirely sure what fighting her even did for us, to be honest, because this is just kind of a dead end. <laughs> and didn't really get anything from it. But uh, it was a cool fight. I enjoyed it. Apparently this is what it did. It gave us access to the three sisters. Whatever that is. There's a dragon. See it off in the distance, chat. Why is he just chilling there? Usually the dragons, like, aren't there. They, like, fall from the sky when you get into range and surprise you. That one's just, like, chilling out in the open world. Sure, not sure what to make of that. Kella's Lily. Rena's Rise. Locked shut for now. Huh. You don't say. Somehow I get in there. I hear you stomping around over there, man. Where we're coming, just hold on. Just hold your horses. We're gonna make our way there eventually. Is this on my map? Yes. Run his rise. Okay. Huh. It's like the edge of the map. Game just ends here. There's nothing any there's nothing further from here. Even a blue blue light invisible wall stopping you from going any further. <laughs> That's interesting actually. Not sure exactly what to make of that. Another tower over here. Okay. Big old dragon boy. All right, not entirely sure what's going on here. Rena's rise, though. Rena's the girl that we met earlier on in the game, like at the very beginning. She's also the one that when we met Renala, he was in the cutscene. I don't want to fight him yet. I will. I will. Don't don't doubt it. Don't think we're not gonna fight him. I want to do it right now. Ash of War, nice. That we don't even use. I don't think we've used a single one yet. Um, yeah. So this is an area, I guess. Skill ahead. I just did it. I just got the skill, man. You're, you're behind. Well. I kinda don't wanna fight him yet. We will, don't doubt it. It's gonna happen. Just kinda trying to figure out what the point of uh, this whole area is, or is fighting the dragon like the main point of this area? Um, bop, 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 bop. I would assume there's got to be at least, like, one grace around here somewhere, right? 
gotta be. There's gotta be. Saluvis' rise. Also blocked shut. But why? But why are they all blocked shut, though? How do we get in? I demand entrance. Don't you know that I am the waiting Elden Lord? I have, like, two pieces of the eight-piece key, dude. Like, how much more do you need? What am I supposed to prove of myself? It's a dead end. So it's called the Three Sisters, right? So I'm assuming there's a third tower around here somewhere. Three Sisters. We don't have access to the towers yet. We gotta figure this out. We gotta figure out how to get access to towers. But we also have to be mindful of where this dragon is so we don't accidentally like aggro him as we're looking around. There's a third tower. So big. What? What's shooting at me? Excuse me? Excuse me? What happened? Something definitely just shot me. I'm not crazy. I'm hearing whispering. What is that? What What's happening? Wolves. The only enemy we've seen so far. One wolf. Ah, uh, this one's open. Ronnie's Rise. What's the other one called? I thought we already saw Ronnie's Rise and it said it was closed. Are there two Ronnie's Rises? Only I had a god. Praise the dog, so to speak. Trail. Wolf ahead, therefore offer rump. What is happening? Grace! Yeah, that was called Ronnie's Rise. Why is the one we're in now called Ronnie's Rise? I'm so confused. There's two of them. Old lovable sort. Are we ever actually going to have gameplay, or is it just wandering around this area? Looking for something. The boss fight? All the way to the tippy top. Top? Love ahead. Why are there so many dead spots on the ground? It's Ronnie. We haven't seen you since the beginning. Again, we cross paths. I believe I said my name was Rena when last. Oh, I forgot. I thought she said it was Ronnie, to be honest. Business hast thou here? I have no memory of ink in thee an invitation. No reason in particular thou claimest. Intriguing. Then mayhaps fate have steered thee to this reunion. Hmm. Wilt thou enter into my service? Sure. I am the witch Rani. I stole the Rena and Rani and search now for the dark path that I might one day upend the whole of it. 
and rid the world of all that came before. So wants to search for the dark path and rid the world of everything. I mean, I'm intrigued. I don't know if. I see. A choice well made. All right. I guess we will. <laughs> Not many would have accepted the offer. We're gonna help her like wipe the entire world clean of life. What do I do? Good. Then I ask we proceed with haste. There is in my service a half woven warrior Blade. by the name of Blythe. Blythe! We join him in searching for the hidden treasure of Nocron, the eternal city. Nocron, the eternal city. Blythe to greet thee below. Take from him the particulars. I've already met Blythe. And there wilt thou find E.G. My war counselor. He's the preceptor in the sword. EG was the also, guy Blad told us to go find. Feel secure in gaining from them. What advantage thou canst. He's that giant uh I'm sure the others will be doing just the same. Blacksmith. Speak with the three who await thee below. Thou needst not indulge them unduly. But they too wish to appraise thy worth. It hath been a passing long time since a newcomer entered my service, after all. Love that ghost face that's attached to a regular face. Such a weird detail. Lover, oh lover, time for pickle. Oh boy. You people, you people. Look at that dragon, man. I don't want to mess with him. He looks like he means business. So she said below. They're, me they're waiting for me. Blythe, which I don't know if we ever actually finished Blythe's quest line because he told us to go find E.G. We found him, but then we never went back to Blythe to talk to him about it. Oh! They're spectral. They're like projecting themselves. War Counselor. I'm told that you are searching for Nocron with Blythe. I will give you whatever guidance I can and pray for your success. It's like the, Apologies for the, the quest line that leads you to the end of the game. I never imagined that an audience, let alone service to Lady Rani, was in your fate. I, for one, should have seen it, but I did not. Do forgive me, my fellow. You're supposed to be able to like tell the future or something. Of ourselves together for Lady Rani. Together for Lady Rani. We can of ourselves together. Together forever. I have five hundred runes. I need twenty thousand to level again. That's gonna take forever. I know we're going to give all that we can for ourselves and Ronnie, okay? I get it. Old lovable sort. Oh, he is, though. He's so cuddly. Such a massive individual. There's Blythe. I never would have guessed that's how you pronounce it. Ah. Long time, friend. Blythe. So tall. Have you forgotten? Glad to have you in the service of Mistress Ronnie. Gotta be like six feet tall. Oh. Like <laughs> taller than that, like seven feet tall. The eternal city of Nocron lies somewhere at the bottom of this land. I'm planning to go below to the well in the Mistwood. See if I can't find the road to Nocron from there. The well in the Mistwood? Where in the world is that? Where in the world is the well in the Mistwood? I'm going below. The well in the mistwood. See if I can't find the road to Nocron. Don't keep me waiting, eh? This word is definitely going through my head. The well in the mistwood. I have no clue where that is. I see. You must be Rani's new hireling. So this is so yes. Sarusi or whatever his name is. I am Saluvis. 
Now I can go into your tower too? Since we have the misfortune of serving the same lady, I ask that you kindly try not to drag us all down with you. Okay. I reside in another tower close by. That's high, but you wouldn't let me in. Pay me a visit. Should you wish to be of actual service to Mistress Rani. So we have to find the well in Mistwood. I wouldn't waste my time on the likes of you. But who am I to stand against the wishes of my lady? I legitimately have no idea where that is. I don't recall ever seeing an area called Mistwood. Let's go check his tower again. Could be wolves out here since we rested, right? Um, I'm stuck. Excuse me, I'm stuck. I not walk any further past this point. What is going on here? Why is it always lovable sort? Oh, it's an invisible wall. What? What's happening? Am I trapped? Why am I trapped? What? First off, not here. Oh, okay. Thank you. An invisible wall made out of fog that's stopping me from going anywhere. Be missing something. What is this? Can't go anywhere. What is happening? What? What the heck? I reside. Yeah, I, I would like to come and pay you a visit, but you guys are like blocking me. You have apparently set up an invisible wall around the tower that I cannot get through. Please, I beg you, let me out. I'm going below to the well and see if I can't find the road to knock on. Let us give together. I did. Maybe I need to go talk to Ronnie again. Rena is what she called herself originally, and then we met her when we fought Renala, so that's kind of weird. Rena and Ronnie. Who me? I would have just guessed her name was Ronnie the whole time. I don't have that good of a memory. I'll soon enter my slumber, and it will be some time before I wake. I guess I had to go talk to her again. Doll's body is not without its hindrances. Still, I have high hopes for thee. I look forward to the good news when I arise. I shall soon, and it will be. I have high look forward to the good. Now can I leave? Please. Pleasies. Pleasies let me leave. He's gone. He is gone. They're all gone. I guess I had to talk to her again to get out of here. All right. Well, that was interesting. There's the wolves. That was weird. Like until you go back up and talk to her again, like the whole area is just blocked off. Can't come or go. All right. So now let's go to the other tower. Saluvi's tower or whatever the heck his name is. Kill me, dragon. I'm just trying to get to a tower. Gosh, the map design must have taken forever. 
What is glowing over here? Shimmering, I should say. Ah, hello. Got him. Ooh, look, there's a way down. I don't want to go there yet. I gotta explore the other towers first. The castle in the background, man. This place has. This game has such a big map. It's just filled with all kinds of stuff everywhere. Should be his tower, yep. Yeah. So Luby's rise. Hello. Well, you took me at my Look at his mask. Did you not realize I was merely being polite? <laughs> he didn't want me to actually come visit him. To amaze. I suppose you're here now. Perhaps I'll give you something to do. Please do. I'd like you to find a woman called Nefeli to administer a She's at the round table. You can do that much, can't you? Good, good. Now I shall hand over the potion in question. Thank you for giving me a narration of all of your actions. She drinks it. I expect glad tidings and soon. Find a Nefeli and ensure she drinks it. She should be at the round table, right? The only thing I will hear from you is a report of your task's completion. Did she leave? Are we understood? Then off you trot. I have enough on my plate. I'm trying to remember, did she say she was leaving? No, the priest said he was leaving because he was going to find Gold Mask. I think Nefeli's still at the round table. I mean, your tower is nothing like Ronnie's tower. You don't even get an elevator, man? Jeez. It sucks to be you. A memory stone. Oh, boy, just what I always wanted. Now we need to go explore the other tower at the entrance before we leave, but then I want to go to uh, Round Table and see if Nefeli's there and give her the... Uh, I just didn't know she was sick. Didn't realize she needed medicine. Thing incredible ahead, therefore ahead, oh head. Uh, where? Talking about. Oh, he's pointing to the castle. Gotcha. Let's go to the other tower, see if we can get in there now. Surely I should be able to enter there now. Or is he talking about here? It's a secret. Secret? Whoa! Secret! That's cool. Lathe's mask. I go back and uh, praise that message, man. I would have never found that without that. Praise you, son. Praise you. Put that on. Ah, very cool. We had the same mask as Blade. We have the same mask as Blade. He thought he was the coolest. Now he's not. I'm the coolest. Where? Where am I going? I'm lost. Help me. I'm lost. I'm stomping around really close. To the left. Oh, there's the... Ah, oh, now I know where we are. Okay, that's the first tower. So, let's go see if it's open now, which it should be. We'll see what's inside. Then we'll go try and find... Oh, it's not open. Interesting. Hmm, 
weird. All right, well, now I guess we can go to the round table, right? Yeah. yeah no, no, no. Let's go in here and uh, rest at the race first. Huh. I don't know why the, this area keeps going further out. Rest at the grace, and then we'll go to the round table, see if we can find... Nefeli. Give her this medicine, and then we'll come back. So much stuff going on all the time in this game, man. Um... Church. Where's Mistwood? East of Tableland? <laughs> Mistwood. Town Bridge. The Bottom Catacombs. Lyernia Highway South. Mistwood. Huh. I don't know. Ray Lucaria. Maybe we haven't been there yet. Hmm. So he's going to a well in Mistwood. Water Coast. Mistwood. Mistwood Ruins. Port Height West. So somewhere in this area, remember. Somewhere in this area is where we need to be. To find the well? I don't remember finding a well around here, but apparently there is one somewhere. A uh, chamber outside the plaza, Red Main Castle. That's where the boss fight was. We could go get the map real quick. Trying to just plan out things that we can do tonight. You shall sank them. Dragon Barrow West. What is this place? I don't know. I just don't know. All right. Well, let's go to here and see if we can find a felling. Nefeli, Nefeli. Remember where she was here? Hey, you said you were leaving. Ah, you appear to be doing well. Very good. Well then, would you like to learn an incantation? Not particularly. May the golden order shine through you. He said he was leaving. To like go find the gold the gold mask. Hello there. Nobody has anything to tell me anymore, huh? Everybody's lips are shut. If I do have a talent for spirit, I suppose I should try I'll ask Master. Oh, nobody's got nothing to say to me, huh? Everybody's tight lipped. Hello. Always good to see you say son. Maybe I should tell you. Lately, I feel I'm on the precipice of falling into a deep, fathomless slumber. And I have an inkling it could spell trouble for you somehow. So I just wanted to get the apology out of the way beforehand, since you're so scary and all. <laughs> ah, so you Appreciate it. D. D is an old friend. We found ourselves journeying together for a time bound by our exploration of death but our paths have since diverged never again to cross though that's hardly an uncommon fate for two friends D was telling me that he discovered the mark of the centipede the centipede is an ancient symbol of the curse mark as long as whoever finds and uses it is not nefarious by nature 
then we may be able to form an alliance. If only I could speak to them in person. Where's the centipede? They were like you. All the better. He really likes us. He likes us. Hey. Okay. Alright, where is she? Where's Nefeli? I need to talk to her right now. Post haste. Post haste. No time to waste. Post haste. Sadness ahead. We haven't even opened it yet. We don't know what's in there. Well, I took you from now back to lay out your own. The girl. What about her? Hmm. Are you out of your mind? Who'd stay with an ugly brute who only knows how to? He thinks speak. very highly of you, sir. Absurd. Besides, she'd never agree to it. I refuse to believe it. I don't doubt you, but I know when something's too good to be true. Hmm. There she is. She's sick. Oh, you. Please, leave me be. It's pathetic, I know, but I... I need to think. Ah, oh, you. No, I got medicine for you. Pathetic, I know, but I... What? I always bug. Is the quest bugged? You can't give her the medicine? What? Ah, oh, you. Please. It's pathetic, I know, but I... That sucks. Huh, maybe we haven't gotten far, far enough in the storyline to trigger something yet. Let's go! If I miss something over here, or just anywhere, really, <laughs> I don't, I don't know, particularly over here. But obviously, we didn't do something right because we don't have the ability to give her the medicine yet. I wonder if that quest is bugged and there's just nothing we can do about it. Suck. Not that I care about like seeing every single quest this game has available to us, but. I've said from the beginning, like anything that we stumble on as we're walking through the game, I'd like to, I'd like to do. Oh, the knight's up here. That's right. Yeah. I'm surprised he's still here. Figured he'd be one of the bosses or one of the mini bosses that like disappears and never comes back. Just kind of want to explore. I feel like this big empty spot on the map is too empty. Like there should be a grace over here or something. Usually when there's a grace, there's also, like, stuff that you need to do. We're good. Fly, fly. I know we have, like, two bosses that we've found that we haven't beaten. So I know that's probably actually where the next place we're supposed to go is, is beat those bosses. But, um... I'm kind of struggling with it, so we're going to try and see if there's another way we can go. Um, stay still. Let me kill you. You know you want that. You know, you know you want it as much as I do. For you to die. Why does that guy seem giant? He is? He's a giant. You're an idiot. Buddy didn't really protect you very well. Just saying. Just saying. No, don't hit me. Refuse to let you hit me. Do the spinny spinny horseback move on him. Always works every time. Slumbering egg. That's a brand new item. We've never seen that before. Behold something incredible. 
Listen. What is that? Check that item. See what it's about. Slumbering egg. I hear. Oh, we have. No, we haven't. Remember seeing it? Prized as a symbol of the most sublime slumber. Owl eggs that will never hatch. Material used for crafting items. Interesting. I wonder why they never hatch. Um. um, um, um. Where to? Where to? I don't know where to go. I don't know where to go. Oh, I don't know where to go. What to do? I don't know where to go. Love how far away you can see the torches that these guys are carrying. They glow from like forever away. All right, so there's something up this way. I think we've already been there, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's the entrance to, uh, yeah, the Grand Lift of Dectus, of course. How could I forget? I guess we didn't miss any Sights of Grace. I thought we would have, judging by the big emptiness in the map. Oh, hi! Why are your eyes on fire? It's very off-putting. <laughs> The old spinny horseback camera trick. Gets him every time, every time. Oh. Hear a lot of more rats? A lot more rats? Here. We're gonna be the point in the game where we're just gonna have to like aimlessly wander to every inch of the map to see what we can find. Seems to be, like, something I end up doing in most RPG games I play. We get to a point where we just get lost, either from not paying close enough attention, or just from the game being purposefully a little, uh, obtuse. Because of that, we get to a point where we're like, well, I can't figure it out, so I'm just gonna wander around aimlessly and hope something happens. Oh, why are we dying? What is happening? What is that sound? Why are we dying? What the heck is that? What? Get out of here! What is this place? Help! What the heck is that place? some item we have to find that like staves off madness or something hear you glittering down there i hear you back here again Visions of tear. Visions of sugar plum dance in their heads. Nope. Anybody there? Anybody there? All right, I guess the next thing we got to do is uh, <clears throat> go look for this well he was talking about, Blade was talking about. Merchant ahead, sir. All right. I don't really know what we're supposed to be doing. Give. Well. 
couldn't give the medicine to Warrior. Whatever her name was, I already forgot. Even though we literally just talked to her like five seconds ago. Um Nefali. God, I forgot about that. My bad. My bad. All right, I don't think I want to be here. <laughs> Let's go look for the well. Uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. All right, let's go. You said Mistwood, right? Mistwood, Mistwood. Mistwood was over here somewhere. Why do I feel like we're not going to accomplish any progress whatsoever in it? Let's have a... Let's go get this map piece, then I'll at least feel like we've made some progress tonight. Then I'll feel better about not doing anything productive for the rest of the stream. All right. To the east, straight ahead from here. God, I hate this area. It's so difficult. Where is it? That way. Hoy, this way somewhere. Oh, my horse got hurt. Is it a horse? To the right. Oh, there it is. Caleb map. Yeah, we found it. We can get the hell out of here and never come back ever again. Hello. This is a really weird place for you to just be sitting. <laughs> Cracked pot champion headband. That's cool. Right helm, that looks very cool. Champion pauldron. Champion bracers. Oh, this is kind of like the stuff that uh, Nefeli was wearing. Champion gators. <laughs> I like this, it looks cool. Hey, we actually have pants on now. Yay. All right. New map has been found. Kaylid. Yes. Got it. Thank you. Um, hey, Mr. Board Games. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? I haven't really accomplished anything in the 45 minutes we've been playing tonight. I've honestly been very lost. Not entirely sure what we're supposed to be doing. Fort Gale just appeared on the map. We go there. Find out what the hell Fort Gale has for us. Rotview Balcony Gale Tunnel. Check out Fort Gale. Is that already on the map before I pick the map piece up? It's going well, that's good. We have like two new quest lines we just picked up this tonight, like just a minute ago. I tried to finish one of them, and I think it's bugged. It won't let me do it. Fort Gale is that big building there. I think we've been in there, haven't we? Hello, bugs. I feel like we've been in here, but I simultaneously feel like if we had been in there, we would have had like a grace or something that marked on the map. 
I remember you being there, but that doesn't mean you haven't. I know we've been near it. I remember seeing it. This isn't the fort that what's his face made us come rescue. That was Fort Hate. Die. Oh, you weren't even looking. <laughs> you idiot. You guys aren't good at defending this place at all. Okay, I take it back. Maybe that's why we never came here. Maybe we came near it once and then that stuff started happening and we were like, forget this. I'm out. I think we have been here. It looks familiar. Oh my god! Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone. Oh, don't fall. Kill, kill, kill. Oh god, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. We're dead. We're dead, we're dead, we're dead. Hmm. Have we been here, though? <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out. By the way, your voice levels sound good. Must have deleted the Logitech software. Um, I tooled around with it. I think I actually was using it wrong the first time. <laughs> so that could be part of it. The word, but I don't believe it. Clearly, we haven't been in there. Otherwise, we would have looted that item. I like how the Steak America brings me, like, right up to the front door. So I think I fixed it is what happened. But I appreciate you giving me some feedback about it. Um, how? How do I get in? Liar red. Do, do, do. I feel like every place that's new to us that we could go to is blocked off. So I honestly don't know what to do next. I really don't want to explore Kaled because Kaled's just a nightmare fire that I don't want to be a part of. How do we get in this place? Go around the other side, check it out. What have you been up to? Playing any other games? I almost bought my Switch today, but then I hesitated and didn't. Oh, not the blood stain. God dang it. What are my rooms? We have been here. I remember. We just noped out as soon as we saw these guys and we were like, nope, that ain't happening. How do I get in it? One of them just killed themselves. Played about 10 hours of Elden Ring the past few days. Sweet. Where are you at? Gotta be a way in. Just gotta be. Die, yeah. It's just gotta be. You jack, you jackass. Get up. God dang it. How do we get in this place? Come on. He ain't telling me jack shit. I found like three new areas we can get to tonight, but every single time, like, this happens and we just get locked out of it. I'm guessing maybe we need to meet an NPC who starts a quest line that allows us to get in here, maybe? 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 To level 60, trying to get the right piece of the medallion to get into the Mountain of the Giants. Where is it? Do you know? I'm so confused as to what I'm supposed to be doing here. Let me in! Sadly in Kaled. Is it in this fortress?
Do you not know exactly where we're at in Caleb? You just know it's in Caleb. Oh, okay, okay. It's in Fort Ferris. Where's that? Cause I need that too. Found it. Found my entrance. Fort Ferris. That's not on my map. Fort Gale. I think we have been here. No, it's just very similar to the other fort we were in, I think. I don't know. I'm so confused. Oh, eat it. Then eat it a second time. I don't want that purple item, but I'm not an idiot. <laughs> Warming stone. It's due south of where the big dragon that gives you the 70,000 runes is. Uh oh. Why haven't you gone? Or have you gone and you haven't been able to get through it? Oh, you jackass. Trying to surprise me. Oh, our sword almost kills these people with one hit. You son of a bitch. I didn't know there were two of you. I have unable to get through. Uh. Oh, I missed. Can't miss. I can't miss like that. Come on. What are you doing? Missing. What do you think you are making me miss? Huh? 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 Eat it. Second fortress beaten. Oh, yeah. Artisan, red mane, knight helmet. Oh, that's cool looking. Look at my helmet, by the way. I've got Blaze's mask. Things coming. It's, I thought I heard someone running up the stairs. It was actually this helmet was behind Saluvi's tower in the Three Sisters. Being the festival of war, honor General Radon with the warrior's glory. It's in your hands, Sir Jaren. What? All of these things are new. I don't know what any of that meant. Star Scourge Heirloom. What the heck is that? I do know that uh, Alexander mentioned the festival earlier, but he told us he was going to meet us someplace to start it. And when we found him underground in front of a doorway, the door was locked and we couldn't get in. So I don't know how to start the uh, Radon's festival. Did this have something to do with it? Perhaps? Castle ahead. You gotta try it. I like Alexander, only happy thing in all of Elden Ring. He does seem mighty happy. Where in the world did you take me? <laughs> I've already been here. It kicked my ass. Okay, hi. Hello. Hello, hi, hello. I'm gonna leave now. <laughs> Oh, God! You can go down there. We're gonna find out. Oh, apparently you can't. Okay, it definitely looked like a spot where you could, but apparently you can't. <laughs> Never mind. Definitely looked like it was specifically made to drop down into. Well, that's fun. That's a lot of fun. You said the second piece of that thing is south of where the dragon was. Where was that? That's like around here somewhere, right? This place? Oh, that's probably it right here. It's probably it right here. Let's go here. Let's go see what this is. It's a dungeon of some sort. No, to the right of there. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Have you found... I don't know. I'm always confused in this game, like, there's so many things that you could go through the entire game without ever seeing. Did 
Did you do the quest for... Oh, it's a tower. Over this way. Follow the road and find out. Did you do the quest to... Follow Blythe down into Necron, the hidden city of gold? Oh... Oh, I didn't know you were a bad guy. <laughs> I thought you were just like environmental stuff. If you follow the road the other way, it will run into it. Oh, gosh. Oh, something's behind me. I have not done that quest yet. That's what I'm working on now. Like, that's the most recent quest we've acquired. But I don't know where the well is. He said he's going to be in a well. He's going to be at a well in Mistwood. But I don't know where there's a well in here. I don't remember ever seeing a well in this. Oh, well, well, would you look at that? Apparently they marked it on my map. Never mind. It's been an age since I've seen a customer. How can I help here at the end of the earth? Oh, you can get samurai stuff. That's kind of cool. If I had any money. Uh, strong foe ahead. Why would you kill the merchant? What's the point of that? Such a nice guy. To so go right. This way. Looks like there's like a... Yeah, I'm running the same Ryan in my game. Nice. Oh, wow, you gotta go like way far down there to get there. There's a castle there. Don't go off the edge, please. I just want to try and look at my map to figure out what castle this is. Oh, we've already been there. Kalim Ruins. Um, if we can just look off of here and see what's down there. Oh, a castle. Why are there so many freaking castles around here? Alexander! The big mamma jamma. Who is that? Somebody with two big blue wands. I kind of want to go down there. How can I get down there? This Caleb place has a lot going on in it. Oh, I almost fell off. Hello. I think I used to be super scared of these things. I just do that and then that oh no yeah I should apparently still be very scared of them I'm dead I'm dead I'm dead oh how did he not hit us Can you please heal thank you how's the samurai is it like easier probably not I would assume the samurai is probably harder right Close enough that I can jump down. Probably not. Why did I do that? Mm. Oh, come on. That was a delayed reaction. There was something under the ground in there. Did you see that? It was like a purple light. It's weird. I don't want to see what this area that... How do I get there? How do I get here? Let's start here. I want to see what Alexander is standing next to. It's like a giant building. He's just chilling there with his arms crossed, like waiting for us. Samurai is nice. A lot of dexterity and quick to hit. Weapon is bleed effect on it at the start. Nice. Go northeast or just straight north? Yeah, just straight north. Hurry. No, hurry! Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> All you see is just this giant mouth opened around my head. Just get it, just get it. Oh, there's nothing in it. What the hell? Trap. That was a trap. They set it and I fell for it. 
all you saw out of the corner of the screen is like this giant toothed mouth wrap around my character's head. I feel like we've tried to get here where Alexander's standing before and like we can't get there. It's too far down. I'll try it just to see. Just to see. North, north. Well played monsters made me jump when it showed up. Yeah, me too. I was scared for my life. There he is. It's so far down there. How do you get there? Follow the trail. It's gotta be a way. Still shooting at us. There's like a giant statue down there. Did you see that? What the hell? How do I get down there? Yeah, there's a house down there. And a grace. How the hell do you get down there? What the heck? It's like a whole nother world underneath the world. Start going downhill. I have no idea how you get down there. Looks like you need to go to the end of the world. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Might be close to it. What's this guy have to say? Lime, I tell you, the very first flower of Ionia bloomed on this very spot. Lania, may you blossom into a goddess. There's the way down. Go around where the big white clump of land is. We can get down there. Oh, hi. Leave me alone, please. Ah, mommy. We go down until we get to the big white lump of land. There was also an area we found a little while ago that like anytime we tried to go into that section of the map, we suffered, suffered from madness and died like instantly. I'm trying to figure out how to like not have that happen. <laughs> Dear customer. Yes, right this way. Right this way. T-Rex dogs make me laugh. Yeah, they are pretty funny. Welcome. Come, trade in our wandering emporium. Please, buy something. I'm hungry. I've been... I think we've already talked to this guy before. This sounds familiar. Please? I don't... Every time I see you, I have no runes, dude. Not a single one. <laughs> Just sell something so we can buy something from him. Although that's kind of messed up. He's telling us he's starving. We're like, hey, can you give me some money, dude? Kinda, kinda running low right now. If you don't mind. We'll come back. We'll come back once we have some runes. If I remember. I probably won't, to be honest. Um, oh. There's a grace right next to him. Uh, so it was near the white clumpy stuff. There's a grace right here. The whole time, there was one right here. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I just want to see what Alexander's doing down here. I'm like, what the hell are you doing way out in the middle of Caleb all by yourself? But I imagine he's really scared of much of anything. Oh, hi. This doesn't look like a place I can go through, actually. Let me see. If only one last time. Your splendid blade dancing amongst the scarlet rot. Wary of scarlet rot. 
I don't think we're going to be able to get through here. Ah, on horseback we sure can. Street of Sages Ruins. What in the world are we about to find? Oh god. Let me out of here. Let me out. Let me out. I'm so scared. They're chasing me. I hear them. So I'm guessing if you get knocked off your horse in this area, it's probably bye-bye. It's probably like instant death. <laughs> Giant... Oh, this is the path! I remember seeing the purple things. This is the way to our friend Alexander. What the heck just happened? What is happening? They need a better county commissioner. Streets of Rage is a bad name for a street. You're not, you're not wrong. These guys always seem to be a sign of something bad ahead. Mm, what is happening? Visions of magic, therefore try physical. Oh, one of these things again. We've fought one of these before. Oh, he's killing us, though. He's definitely killing us. He's dead. Somber Smithing Stone 5. I think that's what we need to level this sword up again. Apparently this was not the way to <laughs> Alexander. I thought it was. First off, bug, but be wary of dead end. This is a dead end. You're not wrong. The world is this place that we found. Ruin fragment. I try and find Alexander, and then once we find him, we'll go back to uh, that well that's marked on the map to find blades and finish his quest. I thought it was the way as well. It looked like it. Let's just hug the outer rim. Oh, we're going the exact opposite way than where we should be going. I want to go north. I go north. There's a cave. North east is a cave somewhere. We already passed it. Huh, it must be up above us, the cave. Weird. Does look like the way, though. Up your torch to see better. You're not wrong. Does look like the way to get to him. It's north. <laughs> Does not look good. Does not look good. Hello, giant egg. Oh, another one of these. <laughs> Took me forever to kill the first one. Just could not figure out the timing. gonna come back up around here get him yes at least they follow a pattern yeah i'll probably just stand here and wait for him to come back oh first try nice poison armament Ooh, that might actually be really good against bosses What the hell? What did I just find? There's a castle down here. Oh, it's not letting me open my map. Apparently something's aggroed on me right now. Celia, Town of Sorcery. 
can't get in. Weird. Can't get in. Let me guess, can't get in? Oh God! Jesus Christ! He came out of nowhere! I don't like this area. Ah! Help me! Now it shouldn't be much of a problem now for you. Have you been here? I just don't like the guys who appear out of nowhere. That scares the crap out of me. Everything is blocked off. I can't get in. That's why everything's been tonight. Like, every single new place I go to explore is like, nope, sorry, you're not supposed to be here yet. Come back later. God, that scared the crap out of me. Yeah, those guys keep you on your toes. Hello. There's two of them. Ah, oh, mommy. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh my gosh. How do you get into those buildings that are blocked off like that? I don't even know if I'm supposed to be here right now or if I should even waste my time. I wanted to figure out how to get to Alexander. Thought we were going the right way, but apparently not. They're in part of the academy in the northwest area of the map. Not sure yet. Gotcha. Oh, we got out of that middle area somehow. Let's go around here. Is there a way to do that? Doesn't look like it. Maybe this way? Oh, this whole Kalid section of the game is just so sketchy. Every inch of it is just, I don't even know. Not enjoyable. Swamp of Aeonia. Hello. <laughs> Sucks to be you. Runar. Nice. I have not used a single one of those yet. Don't even honestly know what they do. Okay, so this is where we were before, I think. Hey, lid. Can't open my map, so something's still aggroed. It looks like to get to Alexandria, you need to go through the Celia Crystal Tunnel. There's a tunnel in Celia Academy, huh? Interesting. Not here. Hmm. Would you just look it up? I've heard that there's apparently like multiple paths that you can get to the same. Hello. Like at a certain point in the game, the game junctions and like you can do different quest lines to essentially get to the same end game, like the same result. And I wonder if that's where we're at now. Like maybe there's like a different quest line I could go do instead of all of this that would get us to wherever it is we're trying to go. There's a map of everything and trace the lines back. Gotcha. Oh, I'm in Celia Crystal Tunnel. What do you know? 
But I've also heard, like, you don't have to kill all of the bosses to beat the game. Like, Radon, apparently we don't have to kill him. Because the way the game's laid out... Apparently you need two great runes to get past where we're at right now. So one is... Um... Godric. And then you can either choose to go here, this way, and fight Renala, or you can choose to go this way and fight Radon. But you only need one or the other. You don't have to have both. So I'm kind of wondering if we're just, like, wasting our time even doing any of this. <laughs> or we could just move on with the game and be like, oh, well, just skip Radon and never see him. Hello, you look like you could kick my ass. Handily. Oh, thank you. Who just shot me? You jerk. Who did that? I don't mean to know. That guy. That guy up there. That guy up there is the one. Hide. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Oh, where is he? I knew he was in here. No, he's on the other side of the wall. God dang. Cheap. Cheap, 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 cheap. Got him. I heard his footsteps. I was freaking out because I thought he was in the room with me. Smithing Stone 5? This place is filled with Smithing Stone 5s? Holy shit. This tunnel sucks. Be careful of spiders. Oh god, I don't like spiders. Gravity Stone? Never mind you handled them well. Oh, those are the spiders? Oh. Yeah, me and my big my big boom boom stick. We tend to tend to not really take long to kill anything anymore. Oh, you son of a bitch. Do that. Don't do that. Oh, something's behind me! Problem with big boom boom stick though is I can no longer carry a shield because this thing weighs a ton. When something sneaks up behind me like that, I just kind of have to turn around and start whacking, start whacking them off. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, Owen Guard, how's it going? Game's going pretty well. Uh, kind of lost. I think I've hit like a point in the game where I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing next. So we're just kind of wandering to see if we can figure it out. Don't you do it again? Don't you do it again? Oh, I thought I made it. How do you get up there? Die, bump. Die, bump. So close to getting this sword leveled to the point where, like, a power attack kills anything with one hit. Oh, that's the way through. Gotcha. No, oh, go! No, he's shooting! He's shooting! Oh, I thought that was the way through. Apparently it's not. Never mind. Um, I'm, I don't know. I don't know that I can't figure this one out. Ah, they can just keep shooting constantly. Pains in the butt. Cracked crystal, that's new. And my game froze. Oh, it unfroze! <laughs> That's the first time we've really had any problems with it in a long time. How do I get to that guy from here? Jerk. Jerk. Miners will attack you. They don't seem to attack me until I attack them first. Ass. Get up there. Heal, heal, heal. You ran. He ran away. What a chicken. Oh, we missed! Oh, thank you. We are using flasks like no tomorrow in here. Holy cow, we already ran out of flasks. Oh, I was trying to reach the beam to see what that item is. They will not attack you. Oh, I misread that. Oh, hi. Please. 
Please, sir. I am just an innocent child. Die, punk. I don't even know what he was doing with that blue rod that he shoved at us. Be wary of liar. We already had that on earlier. So many smithing stones, dude. Owen guard, you've you've uh you've uh you seem to know a lot about the game. What do I do? What do I do next? Where do I go? Somber smithing stones, man. They're good. They're good. Need to make sure I get out of here alive and don't lose all my runes. No, I don't have any. I don't have any. I don't have any. I don't have any means of healing. You're going to kill me. Go. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Please, I just want to. I just want to live. Please, sir. I would just love to live. I don't have any flasks left. How did you get here? Um, <laughs> couldn't tell you, <laughs> to be completely honest with you. We just kind of went wandering blindly. But I just meant, like, in general, what do I do next in the game? Because I'm, like, completely baffled. Every new place I've found is blocked off. Has, like, literally a lock on doors, and it's like, you can't come here, sorry. Like, shit, what am I supposed to do? But this is, like, in the underground area of Kaelid. We're in, like, some secret tunnel under Kaelid. Really don't want to die, man. Let's try clearing Kaelid. Yeah, but that's what I was just talking to uh, Mr. Board Games about, is I understand it as, like, you don't even have to. Like, the boss of Kaelid is an optional boss at this point for me because we've already killed Renala. Like, we don't even have to fight, uh... The Kaelid main boss in order to progress through the game is my understanding of it. Like, you only need two great runes. I already have two great runes. You need to find both medallion pieces to get to the Mountain of the Giants. Ah, uh, that's right. That's what we were doing before I got sidetracked and wanted to come here. You want to skip it? I mean, if I don't need to fight Radon, then what's the point, right? Although I have heard from multiple people who have played this game that, like, Radon's the coolest boss in the entire game. You scared the shit out of me. We're gonna die. We're gonna die here. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. A stupid little other player's ghost man scared the shit out of me and threw me off, man. Stupid, stupid other people playing this game. How dare you? You know how long it's going to take us to get back there? All day. Why didn't ask me? Oh, it's not the Stake America. Never mind. Gosh, it's going to take us so long to get back there. My runes. Can I go this way now? No, it's still closed. That sucks. My runes, they're broken. Okay, well, we're not fighting you. Bye. I can't stay still. If I stay still, I'm going to get hit by a spiderweb. I don't want to get hit by a spiderweb. Get out of here, man. Get out of here. Ah, save yourself. Make it. We made it. You jackass. Oh, he fell. Oh, we don't have to worry about him. See ya. <laughs> Bye. Peace out, Boy Scout. That would suck. What happened? What do you do if you get stuck in there where that guy left the message? You just have to, like, restart the game. Don't skip Radon. Radon is cool, but difficult, in my opinion, if you don't have all the allies. Ooh! Why did I not remember you're in here? Thank you for not being out of range. I appreciate that. One more, one more, one more. Then finish her. I feel like I want to be full health coming out here. 
I'll fight Radon. I think we have all the allies. Like, I'm pretty sure that's all the quest lines I've been doing is collecting all the allies for him. Because we just met, like, three new ones right before I came here. We met uh, Ronnie, uh, EG, and Saluvis, I think his name was. He had a weird name. Okay, don't lock on because I can't see anything. You ass! You just bonked me on the head. <laughs> What a jerk. Just straight up bonked me on the head while I was climbing the ladder. Oh, hi. What the fuck? Good night. Now, this is where the guy scared me last time. Be surprised. There he is. Okay. Oh, I tried to dodge. Heal, 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 heal. Before he does this crap. Oh, you ass. You got it hidden. The spiders do suck. You're right. Holy cow. Dragon wound grease. That made me truly laugh out loud. What the bonk on my head? I thought it was pretty funny, too. It didn't even look like he was really swinging it. He was just like, bonk. Hello. Hi. Hello. Did I interrupt something? I, I might not just... I might I might just go this way. Catch you guys later. See you around. <laughs> that item can't be that good. That item cannot be that good. Be wary of a head. Boss ahead. So there's gotta be... There's gotta be a, a grace down here somewhere. Or not. Never mind. Want to go home? You have to get all the way back through this entire thing to get back to the boss fight? Are you crazy? There's no grace between the entrance and here? That seems insane. Eat it. Yeah, that's right. What are you going to do? Your friend's dead, bud. Your friend is dead, bud. Oh, shit. I'm dead. I'm dead, bud. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Heal. Die. Punky Brewster. You punky Brewster. Faithful's canvas talisman. I should really read all these talismans we've been getting and see what they do. First off, well done. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. No grace except at the very beginning. That's a shame. Take a look at all these talismans. Slowly restores HP. I have no idea why we haven't been using that. Raises strength. Oh my God, as if we need that. I'm using it. Raises proficiency of incantations. Where's FP, enhances roars, raises attack power. Reduces damage and impact of headshots. <laughs> I am going to... I forget how to put those on. Raises stamina, recovery speed, enhances final hit of chain attacks. I don't really need that. I don't really need the fire negation right now either. Oh, we're even stronger. This boss drops Somber Stone Miner's Bell Bearing, Somber Smithing Stone 6, Smithing Stone 7, and Gravity Stone Chunk. Interesting. We'll try him. We'll try him out and see what he's about. Boy Scout. Is there a Steak America here, hopefully, please? The slowest, heaviest doors in the history of the world. Falling Star Beast. He's made of crystal! Holy shit. Takes half of my health out in one hit. And we missed. 
Damn it, we keep missing. We can't keep doing that. <laughs> no, get out of there. Oh, I thought I had no flasks left. I just looked and saw the two. Oh my gosh, dude. We can just run here through this place and get to him with all of my flasks. He's done. We already had him down to like two thirds health. We can just run through this cave without getting hit. It'd be hard to do since we have to jump over that rooftop at one point. Getting so sidetracked right now. I should be like trying to actually accomplish like story stuff, but I feel like I'm I feel like this challenge is just waiting for me to beat it. Oh god, that sucks, man. I hate that shit. Die, punk. Get out of here. Damn it. I missed, I missed, I missed, son of a But there's no way to run through this place. When you jump down, you should see if you can break the logs down to create a shortcut. Mm. Good idea. Tried to break them from the outside, but I guess that's the whole point of a shortcut is you can't open it from the outside. And if we beat this guy and have enough time left of the stream tonight because tonight's going to be a little bit shorter of a stream uh we will go and try to get that right piece of the medallion you were talking about too oh there goes five thousand runes by the way don't even go up there just go stop stop yes Oh, uh, if only. If only that worked. Would have been nice. You butt. How is that even possible? I forgot. I forgot again. Son of a bitch. We're just running. <laughs> We're just running from this point. Son of a bitch. Not doing well with the whole run through without taking any damage. Why do I keep missing the damn ladders, man? Is my character blind? Where's this ladder go? I don't know. Don't wanna don't wanna find out. There's gotta be a shortcut in here someplace. Okay, we got four. That's better than the two we had. And the zero I thought we had. Good start, good start. Nice, didn't whiff this time. What the hell? Where am I? <laughs> I'm stuck. You stunned. Oh, this guy's dead, dude. Oh, he moved. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, stop healing. Just fight. Just fight. Okay, we're dead. <laughs> wow. <laughs> thought we had him. I thought we had him. He turned into Sonic. He did indeed. So all it takes to stun him is two power attacks. So that's good to know. Man. It's just such a pain in the ass to run through this whole tunnel the entire time. 
gotta be a shortcut someplace. Like, it's not like this game to not have a shortcut. Imagine. Just imagine. <laughs> you break the wall and it just turns you, like, takes you right into his room. We could, please, sprint straight up into his little house and just fight him instantly. That would be great. Oh, yes. Thank you. No, 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 no. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. Stop. Oh, my God. The game is driving me nuts. The freaking lock-on system in this game pisses me off more than anything. It just automatically locks on to whoever's closest. Or at least it seems to, unless I'm pressing something I'm not supposed to press. I forgot about you again. Yeah, that's right. Scare me once, fool on- shame on me. Scare me twice. Shame on you. If we go this way, nope, dead end. Oh, I even thought that was gonna be a good idea. Go up the damn ladder, you son of a bitch. Where am I? Where am I right now? We're so dead. <laughs> We're so dead. I don't know how we get out of here without being dead. I don't get it. This is like one of the worst things in the world is having to run through this whole damn thing every time. That was chaos. That was just an uncontrolled chaos that time. There was absolutely nothing going right. This feels like it should be a shortcut, though. You're definitely right. I feel like you should be able to break that open somehow. Imagine. Imagine if you could have just done this the whole time. Wait for it. Break the game. God, this guy's an asshole. I'll give this guy like two more tries. We'll know he's here in the future. So if we don't kill him this time, we'll just come back later. I want to like actually progress the storyline. And I feel like what we're doing now has absolutely no impact on this storyline whatsoever. But you said this is what leads us to where Alexander is. Maybe this does impact the storyline. asshole die you asked how did i miss come on my sword went through his character model i thought it leads to him that was the cheapest miss i've ever seen in this entire playthrough so far Dude, this game's driving me fucking nuts like the last 10 minutes, dude. Climb the damn ladder.
Oh, you bitch. No! Don't knock me off, you stupid piece. My God, this is torture. How do you get up there? I want, I have something I want to try. I forget every freaking time, dude. <sighs> about to lose my fucking mind on this game in about five seconds. Go up the ladder. Or the Alexander quest, he is by the rear Gale Tunnel entrance. Interesting. Thank you. You stupid piece. None of you guys gave me any problems like a million times. Just kill me. Just, just put me out of my misery, dude. Just do it. Oh my god! The Gale Tunnel entrance. Is there a Fort Gale? Fort Gale, so I wonder if there's a tunnel inside there we missed. On the left edge of Kaled. Well, now I'm just determined to beat this piece of crap. Pissing me off. There's so many moving pieces at all times that can go wrong. Like, you fall down, you're screwed. You let this guy hit you with his web shot, you're screwed. Already used a flask. There's something I want to try. Oh, no! We finally made it, and I missed it. Okay, don't forget this guy's here. So I've been reading a lot of articles recently about how, like, I guess they, uh, delayed Breath of the Wild 2 to, like, spring of 2023 when it was supposed to come out in, like, October of this year. And a lot of the articles I'm reading are saying that it's not Breath of the Wild 2 that got delayed. Supposedly, a lot of industry experts think that Breath of the Wild 2 is going to come out with a Switch Pro console. And the Switch Pro console is what was delayed. I'm like, interesting, that's fascinating. Hope those guys can't climb ladders. Bitch. Get out of here. Yeah, they, they can. Oh, a three for... Oh, stop swinging, you madman, stop. This has got to be it. Thank God. Now, where is that? Let's go down just so we can find out where it's at. Saw it last time we were here, and I was like, that's got to be the shortcut. Oh, nice. That's a good shortcut. That's like right at the beginning, right? Yeah, because there's the spider, dude. Come around the corner. Boom. Here. Nice. That'll make this a lot easier, <laughs> okay? Man, I knew there had to be one somewhere. I was going crazy. That's so cheap. Punk. 
Get off my back. This time you'll kill the boss and not need the shortcut, probably. It's just how our luck works. Didn't trigger. That was horrible timing. Nope. Oh, thank you. Don't let him grab you. You ass, man. Come on, come on, come on. Get out of the way. Heal, heal, heal. Get up. One more, one more, one more. <laughs> nice somber smithing stone six smithing stone seven gravity stone chunk gravity stone chunk somber stone miners bell bearing holy cow man how many runes did he give us i thought there was like a way out Man, oh man, oh man, never have to come into this bullcrap again. <laughs> nice, okay. Man. 11,000 runes. That's only halfway to another level. Unlock the shortcut for no reason. Exactly. Yep, you called it. That's funny. Never gonna have to use that shortcut ever. Oh wait. Hello. Good to see you again. Oh, she's here with him now. That's cool. I you to thank, don't I? For persuading Master Hugh. Oh, that's cool. I can happily announce that he has taught me the noble toil of spirit tuning. I'm as yet unsure of what I might be able to accomplish, but. If I might be able to help you all, I'd certainly like to try. And if there's any chance to ease the suffering of my dear men who were grafted, well, I certainly must try. Roderica, the spirit tune apprentice. <laughs> Pleased to make your acquaintance. That's very cool. Ralister, hats off to you. I oh, know I don't have a hat. I gotta find a hat, guys. Welcome to the stream, by the way, Ral. How are you? I uh, was thinking about you earlier today because I almost uh, went and I was like five seconds away from buying another Switch Pro so I could play. Uh... Man, I'm clashing hard. We got a bright blue hat and a bright red shirt. I almost bought another Switch Pro so I could play some Xenoblade Chronicles. Wait, what does Spirit Tuning do? 
the spirit tuning menu, you can spend runes and grave glove words to strengthen the spirits you summon from ashes. Strengthen named spirits, you'll need ghost glove words. You have to go this far into the game to be able to level these things up? Holy cow. I don't even use them. Kind of looks like a reverse Papa Smurf. <laughs> I think we should be able to level this sword again. Oh! <laughs> Somber Smithing Stone 7. Man, we're getting so powerful with this sword, dude. This sword might be the only thing I use for the rest of the game at this point. We were just talking a minute ago about how, like, it's so close to one-hit killing everything in Kaelid. Now it just might. Digging the combo, I thought you had a Switch. I did a long time ago, but then I sold it because I was like, well, there's no games coming out. I'm even vaguely interested in playing. Wow, that thing will hit super hard. Only just finished streaming with Nate. Conan saps your time. It does. I tried to play Conan for a while, but I think I had like 20 hours into the game and felt like I had absolutely nothing done. This guy definitely told us a little while ago he was leaving to go find Gold Mask, and he hasn't left yet. I don't know how to trigger his storyline to keep going. Let's see if we can talk to... Her. I have a potion that a magister gave me to give to her because apparently she's dying but like I don't know if the quest is bugged or what but I come here to talk to her and she doesn't talk to me she refuses oh, to you. please leave me be see it's pathetic I know but I I need to think I don't know what I'm supposed to do there or if I'm just supposed to wait until I get further into the game maybe it like triggers the next step of the quest once I get further so much easier with a group primate our home you're the armorer nate made stairs that's exciting good for him i'm, I'm glad glad he made himself useful <laughs> stairs of all the things he loves those uh he and cryptic both love those uh survival base building kind of games they've never really appealed to me at all I try every one that comes out just to see if it will be the one that catches my interest, but... Journey to the capital, Landell. To the east of the Altus... We haven't even found Altus Plateau yet. The, uh, tree. the two fingers will deny your passage no longer. You may be our best hope. Find your way to the Elden Ring. Sounds like Taken. I think he found his calling. Oh, show him Saluvis's potion. It is. Bloody Salavis. I suppose he's up to something again. Oh, I won't interfere. You go ahead and do what you must. The round table has no code to speak of. Ooh, uh oh, what does this mean? <laughs> I ask you this. Are you really going to do the bidding of that twisted dolly botherer? Or would you rather hand that potion to me? And see if we can't get one over on the bastard. I don't know. What's it do? I thought it was going to help her, but now he's making it sound like it's going to kill her. Be bored playing on my own for sure. Yeah. For sure. Those kinds of games definitely seem community driven. Um, I guess I'm going to hand it over to him. Like he does make a point. Like we're all inside. I love my mask, by the way. We're all inside the round table hold together, and this guy from outside is trying to get this potion to come in. Seems like he's probably up to no good. Yeah. I'll dispose of the potion myself. You go and see Salavis, but don't give anything away. Just tell him that you tricked your mark into drinking the potion, as planned. Despite knowing next to bloody nothing, He's so far up his own ass, he won't suspect a thing. His inevitable display of arrogance will certainly be a sight to behold. Like, he's never steered me wrong. But I don't know if Nefeli was sick. That's what he told us, is Nefeli was sick and he gave us, like, a potion to give to her. Ah. You've already heard. Indeed. It seemed the whelp harbor. 
harbored suspicions, so I had no further use for her. Honestly, what's a man to do? A determined plebeian is more wicked than an omen horn, quite frankly. I suspect that's just what the Queen wants. A dose of ambition to incite the tarnished. Emotional damage! <laughs> Emotional damage. I think I just got duped, dude. I think getting off here just duped me. Find the Albinoric woman. She hides in a cave to the west of the Laskia ruins, which jut from the mist-shrouded lake of Leonia. She knows the location of the medallion's counterpart, I'm sure. Huh. Too much stuff going on. That was the most expensive emotional damage. I feel like I did just experience emotional damage. I think I either got lied to by uh, this guy or the other guy. One of these two guys is lying to me. I don't know which one. I don't like it. So he essentially said that like he had to toss Nefeli downstairs because she was trying to get like too big for her britches, if I'm understanding what he said too much. He said she was starting an uprising of Tarnished and he couldn't have it. Please, leave me be. It's pathetic, I know, but I, I need to think. Now she's down here. Oh boy, we're about to start like this trifecta of quarrels in between all three of these people. You know already, do you? Right. It's true. That's her dad. My father cast me out for indulging my emotions, forgetting the mission. I think we already knew that, but I forgot. Father, mother, Lord Gideon has offered me guidance all my life. I would have done anything for him to place him on the throne of Elden Lord. And yet I, though it was not my intent, I betrayed him. Oh shit. And I can no longer trust him, Father, to think he'd order his men to enact such tragedy. Where is the justice he purports in that? He once told me that if he became Elden Lord, he would never allow the downtrodden to be cheated ever again. Was he simply lying to me? What if... I'm wondering if this is how the storyline could have gone. What if we gave her that potion that Saluvis gave us and it, like, enraged her and, like, made her, like, bloodthirsty and she went through Round Table Hold and just massacred everybody? No. No. Like, that would be crazy. How could I say that? Father has always given me his guidance. And now... I've lost it. I just, I'm super paranoid about Round Table Hold being, like, bombarded by somebody and everybody dies. Because we've had a quest earlier in the game where we came to Round Table Hold, and there was, like, one of those invaders. And he invaded Round Table Hold. And it was, uh... Ofnir's, uh... Uh, bodyguard he like went crazy and like started trying to kill us so we had to kill him no no how could i say father has always and now i just feel like at some point in the game there's going to be some part of the storyline where someone comes in here and tries to like kill everybody because this is like the safe haven this is where nothing bad happens uh now that i think about it maybe we shouldn't trust off near i kind of regret giving him the potion now because when his bodyguard went crazy and tried to kill us all, he was like, ah, oh, it's just what they do sometimes. What are you going to do about it? Sorry, I guess. I guess that probably should have given me a hint of an idea that this guy might not have our best interest in, in mind. To the east of the Altus Plateau, at the foot of the Erd Tree, the two fingers will deny your... You may be out. Where did he say this girl is? She hides in a cave to the west of, west of the Laskier Ruins. ruins. Best of the last year ruins. For now, let's go here because I'm supposed to be meeting Blythe here. Um, yeah, the river well. It's the closest way to get there here. Blythe is in the river well. He's about to go down under the under Liurnia, and we're supposed to be meeting him there to continue his storyline. We have like four different quests going on simultaneously right now. We go south. Follow the road. This hat's actually kind of comfy to wear underneath these headphones. 
Thank you, Rallister. She does have daddy issues. She definitely does. I have such a bad memory, like any game that's this long. Like I always forget, like, did we already find this before or did they add it to my map because I have the quest for it? Because there were like three times tonight so far where like things have popped up on the map that I don't remember ever seeing. But all of a sudden they're just there and they're named and they're marked and everything. I'm like, what in the world? Where'd that come from? Did we see that or is it just because the game wants us to go there now? I don't recall ever coming in here. I can say that for pretty confident fact. Just wanted you to be comfortable and stylish at the same time. I appreciate it. You're really watching out for me. Did you like Conan? Was it enjoyable? Oh, maybe we did come here because I remember the never-ending elevator. Right when you think it's going to stop, it just keeps going. <laughs> I wonder if Blythe is going to be mad that we're totally cosplaying as him. We have his mask, we have his fur <laughs> cloak that he has. It would actually be hilarious to me if they programmed the character to make a dialogue statement about you looking like him if he sees you like this. So now I'm going to be confused because I don't know if we were supposed to meet him outside of the well or if he's down here in the well. I don't want to go through this entire dungeon just to find out he wasn't here and we should have just talked to him outside. I don't think we ever came through here though. We came down, got that sight of grace and then just instantly noped out and left. I was like, this looks like a really hard place. I don't want to be here. The interesting thing about this game, my natural way to play most games is just go straight through the main storyline from start to finish and be done and never do any of the side stuff, never see any of the extra stuff that the game has. Like, for some reason, this game really, like pulls me into the side quests because it's like the only time the game actually gives you any story it's like when you're doing all the side quests so that's like the part of games i like the most is the story stuff so it's like a weird change of pace for me in this game because typically i would just shoot right from the beginning of the game straight to the end and just ignore everything else because that's how you typically get your story this game it's the exact opposite it's like to get any piece of lore whatsoever you have to like go out of your way and do all the side stuff Oh, a dead merchant. Silver Firefly. Oh, I was like, oh, he just showed me a secret. How are you feeling about the game today? Uh, we've had some... There's always moments. <laughs> In this later part of the game, there always seem to be moments where we get a little heated, a little salty. There were some moments earlier today where I was like, F this game. But, like, generally speaking, I still think it's a really cool game. Like, the world did I stumble on? It's mind of their own business. Yeah, they're not even attacking me. It's cool. I'm not gonna fight you. Do your thing, man. They're just fishermen. I really can't see what influence that Game of Thrones writer had on the story. Um, I don't know. Part of me wonders if, like, all of the lore is his. Like, if he wrote, like, all of the actual story of the game. They just built a big open-world RPG to fit the story into. Or the other way around. They had, like, a big open-world RPG with no story. Like, I've always assumed all the Dark Souls games are, but maybe I'm wrong. Then, like, he wrote a big story to fill, fill around the world. I never assumed, or let me think of another way to rephrase that. 
I've always assumed the Dark Souls games in general just have no story. Like, I've always assumed it's just like a big game that you just play through, fight a bunch of bosses, it's incredibly hard for the sake of being incredibly hard, then the credits roll and you're just like, well, that was completely, like, 30 hours of just hard boss fight after hard boss fight with absolutely no storyline whatsoever. <laughs> like, that's what I always assumed Dark Souls games were. I could be wrong, but... Stop running. Stop running. You're always incredibly hard to control when you're running. Soap? I got soap, guys! I can take a bath! All we can see is the bosses all have initials G, R, and M. Oh, really? Guess that never really dawned on me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Elevator. Elevator me. Or elevate me, I guess. I can see where he had input on the dragons and some enemies. A lot of them remind me of White Walkers. I just always assumed Dark Souls games are just, like, the shell. And, like, he actually added a storyline to it. Oh, that's cool looking. Look at that. Go ahead, ahead. You're not lying. What's that? Torrent, calm down. Group ahead. A horseback battle ahead. Not here. Observing boluses. Kind of wondering where we're supposed to be finding Blade down here. And I'm kind of wondering why his name is pronounced Blathe when it's not spelled that way at all. <laughs> I would have assumed it was pronounced Blade. Every time any NPC talks about him, they say Blathe. Oh, hi. Just killed one of your babies, you monster. Fine. Oh, okay. I was going to say, have I been having to interact with these this whole time and haven't been doing it? This area is huge. I assumed it was like just a regular dungeon, but now I'm starting to think it's like a whole nother world. Map. Uh oh. That makes me a little worried. Why I did that. Input, maybe? They made it sound like he constructed this amazing story. I mean, the story of this game so far is pretty cool, from what, like, I can connect. Um, apparently there's, like, six of these, eight of these that I have to light. Yo for river, how big is this place? Holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> Where is he? I don't want to go through all this. I just wanted to talk to Blave. Hallowhorn grounds. Seek fire. Oh, I have to light all the fires. I get you. I wish the one thing this game doesn't have... Well, I won't say the only thing, but one of the things this game doesn't have that I wish it had is, like, some sort of quest tracking system. Like, you can open up a journal and, like, read the quest notes. Because I kind of wish I remembered what Blade said. He said he was going to be down here, but I can't remember where he said he would be. Hello? Hello? None of the enemies seem to attack you. I don't know. Go too soon. Inverted Hawk Heater Shield. Sweet. New shield. We haven't seen a new shield in, like, forever. The whole system just crashed on me. Thanks, Windows. Windows loves you. Oh, you might have to upgrade to Windows 11 like I did. It's the only way. 
Oh my god, the sword's almost too strong now. Either that or we were supposed to come here a long time ago. No difficulty whatsoever anymore. It's me and death, that's it. It's me welcoming death to all of my enemies. There's gonna be eight of these towers to light in this place, huh? Excuse me, excuse me, please don't. There's another tower. Kind of interested to find out where that teleporter brings us, but I don't want to do it yet. Hello. Oh, you're pigs. You're not even a bad guy. Why am I attacking you? Or pigs? I apologize. Thought you were bad guys. Already on Windows 11? Only have Windows because of gaming? Yeah, I'm still completely, like amazed how much of a performance difference Windows 11 made with this game. Usually operating system upgrades don't really affect gaming specifically that much, but this was like a night and day difference. And I haven't really had any performance hiccups at all this entire playthrough since we upgraded to Windows 11. Hey, stay still. You're dead. I love how they fly. Did you complete Ronnie's quest? Uh, this is it. I think this is part of it. Because she told me to go... I went to Ronnie's tower. She said to go talk to Blaze and EG and a couple other people. When I talked to him, Blaze said, Okay, well, if you really want to do what we need to for Ronnie, then come meet me in this well that I'm in right now. Uh, excuse me, I just wanted the runes. Thank you. I don't, like I said earlier, I don't actually know if I was supposed to come in here and meet him or if he was waiting outside and I just walked past him. We have yet to actually fight one of these and I'm not planning on doing it right now. <laughs> Hello. This place is huge, man. Oh, that's the glove ward it was saying that I needed to upgrade my ashes. I think this is like under the main map. It's gigantic. Oh, we already lit this one apparently? This one did. Lathe, is that you? Are you here? Did you light this? Blink yes if you can hear me. Right, I said blink yes. But yeah, I think we're in the process of doing Ronnie's quest, which is why we're here. We're all walking towards something. The area is kind of creepy. Two for two for ha 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 ha. Nice. Stop running. It's so hard to control when you're in a full sprint. Here's another tower or three. Hello. He 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 doing something. Doing something. This one. Why, what happens if I complete Ronnie's quest, huh? Huh? Is it the end of the game, huh? Is the credit run, huh? What is that? I wish I bought the binoculars a long time ago so I could see what that is out on... Ooh, a jawbone axe. Sweet. Like something sitting out on the end of... Oh, weird. Area is so big, man. Let's see what's over here. Hello. 
<laughs> he hurt himself attacking me. How does that even happen? Man. This way. No, oh, but Ronnie's quest is fairly lengthy. It looks like to continue Blade's quest. There he is. Hello. I look like you. Aren't you proud of me, Danny? <laughs> That's kind of silly. I'm like a mini me. Apologies, mate. But I don't have much to report. I can see bloody knock on. Why do you bother me? <laughs> but I'm absolutely stumped. I tried all the gateways to no avail. Perhaps it's time to ask Celebus. I recall that spiteful little rat acting like he knew something. Let's give him a squeeze. Show him just how sharp my teeth are. Oh, you said this quest line is really long? I jest. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. Besides, uh, I should check on some things here. Leave this place to me. You just do what you feel is right. He said that he saw Nakron above him, but I don't see anything. Tell the other. Right? Leave this place to me. If either of us learns it, and if we reach, Celebus rarely gives us. So he wants us to go talk to Celibus again, which we need to go talk to him again anyway to accuse him of trying to kill our best friend. The round table hold. It's like I don't even know who she is. I don't know why I have such a hard time remembering the names of characters in this game. I guess it doesn't help that like some of the names are ridiculous. Oops. in. All right, then. Ooh, nice. Thank you. What was her name? Uh, Nefeli. The only reason I ever remembered is because of the Nefelim and Diablo. Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to be here. I think I messed up. <laughs> I don't think there's any way for me to get back. Uh, I messed up. Oh, there's a bridge. Welling arrow. Okay, well, take that, I guess. Quite literally a dead end. Then we save that. I don't want to continue... Searching around here for a bit, see if we can find some more of these towers to light, and then we'll go talk to Civilis or whatever his name is, Saluvis. I don't really care, because I hope he dies by the end of the game. Seems sketchy, but then again, maybe Ofnir was actually the one tricking us to take the potion away from us before we gave it to Nefeli. It's interesting if that's the way it plays out, like, depending on what decisions you make in the quest, it could actually impact the game permanently. Because, like, multiple people playing the game could experience completely different end games. And I have heard this game has multiple endings. I don't know how many. But I have heard there are multiple. I don't think we can kill these things. I can kill you. Start. That's no Kron! Why was he looking the other direction? He definitely was not looking there at all. <laughs> city of Gold, he said. It's called Nokron, the ancient city of gold. Definitely looks like a city of gold. Where was it? I got to turn around. Where was it? It looks so cool. Now I can't see it because I got to turn around. Look at it. It's shining. It's gold and all of its splendor over a dozen endings. Holy shit. The one... Help. Help. The one storyline I do want to make sure we finish by the end of the game is the one with the girl eating the eyeballs. <laughs> if it's not already done. I know we fed her three of them and then she puked her brains out, so it might be over. Uh, excuse me, one of these towers is broken by the looks of things? Oh, 
Fine. You jerk. Eat it. You eat it too, just because. Because your friend there pissed me off. Now you're both gonna eat it. Because of him. Dozen endings, really. That's wild. I wonder what, like, changes the endings make, or if there is an intended ending somewhere among all of those. Hello. Goodbye. Behold, house. You're not lying. I'm actually impressed with my own ability to get as far as we have in this game, to be honest with you. Since it's my first experience with a From Software game, I'm kind of surprised we've gotten as far as we have with as little trouble as we've had. I was slightly wrong. Turns out there are six different endings. Still quite a few. Yeah, it's still more than most games. I can't even remember the last time I played a game that had six endings. Lost track of how many things we've lit. Hello. This is actually a decent place to grind for ruins, too. Look how many I'm getting just from killing these blue guys. Excuse me, sir. If you would just stay still. Just for one second. Thank you. wonder if Blade has thought about, like, lighting these towers. <laughs> like... I don't know why, but it just seemed to be the first thing that came to my mind when I came down here. He's just standing up on that cliff staring at the city like, Wow! I have no idea. Nothing's coming to mind. No, attack the other direction. Thank you. Square off. I have so many Ashes of War and I never use any of them. Another teleporter. Holy cow. I wonder if that first teleporter would have brought me here. Or if there are two teleporters that bring you two separate places. Who knows? Who really knows? Another tower. We can't be far off from getting all of them at this point. Like, I know I've gotten at least six. Kill the rats because I ate them. Thank you. And make him fly. Gosh, this sword is so damn powerful. <laughs> I almost feel we're borderline overpowered for this area. Is it going to tell me in some way when I've lit the last one? Like, is the whole world going to shake under me, under my feet? The ground's going to split open and fiery depths of hell are going to spew out over it? really epic like that maybe Did you just die like seriously had your fun you've had your fun no no not like this not oh you sons of bitches that's why i hate the rats that's why i hate the rats i've watched all the endings and understood none of them sounds about right <laughs> i still haven't really put much of the story together yet other than apparently renala used to be married to the king and then he left her to go marry America. That's about as far as I've gotten. America had a husband, but she like shunned him and kicked him out of the kingdom. I don't remember who that was, though. First husband. I can't remember which character that was. What are they doing? They're, like, doing some sort of ritual dance or something. You will not stop me from my 9,000 runes. Look at him. He's doing, like, a dance. Oh, they're dancing a ritual to no cron. Interesting. You dirty rats. What was the name of America's first husband? I already forgot. There's too many names in this game. Can't keep them all straight. I think he started with the R. 
Or not, now that I think about it. Roger, that might have been it. Like, the game gives you so little lore, like, in such rare instances that you go hours and hours of the game without hearing any more of the story. And then when you do hear another piece of it, you're like, oh, I vaguely remember all of these names you're mentioning right now. <laughs> it's been like three hours since I've heard about them. Although in this game, it's more like 10 hours. The amount of time in between story pieces is like insane. It's a mommy. I don't know why I just healed. That was a waste. Oh. Get away from me. You filthy rats. One hit kill. My sword's insane. My sword is unstoppable. I don't want to construct your own story game. I need to be fed it. Well, that's what's in my opinion, or what little I know about Dark Souls games in general, is that's what's actually unique about this game, is it has a story. Like, from my understanding, I don't think any of the other story, like, <laughs> apparently the other games have, like, lore, but, like, it's almost like, I don't know, player created or something. Like, I don't really understand how the lore works in those games. Then again, I've never played them, so I could be just completely making shit up off the top of my head. I just, that's always... I don't like that. Oh, God. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. Not here, not now. That's just always the sense I got from Souls games is like, oh, there's no story. You just like go in here, kill bosses, and uh, that's it. Please, no. Please, no. Not like this. Not like this. You're dead, dude. You made the biggest mistake of your life. so close to something i can feel it <laughs> like this game explains a lot of the story to you in the cutscenes that you see but my biggest complaint about it so far is like the cutscenes are very few and far between you literally play the game for like 20 hours in between a cutscene and you have to go back and remember like wait i i don't remember what who's that what's that guy's name again radagon roderick It was Radagon, yeah, because Radagon's wolf dog thing was in uh, Rael Ducaria guarding uh, Renala. And I was like, why the hell is this dog here? That doesn't make any sense. And you found out, like, after you beat her that, like, Radagon was at one time her husband, but then he left her to go marry Merica, who was, like, the queen of this whole land. But no, that still doesn't answer my question, because I'm still trying to remember who Merica's original husband was. I don't know lost I mean they all have stories but they're so open to interpretation and very convoluted I think a large part of the lore is to keep it a mystery and learn it yourself all you know when you start is you're a tarnished and want the Elden Ring to become an Elden Lord yeah and then the Elden Ring was broken into pieces by Merica and when she broke the Elden Ring into pieces all of her offspring took parts of it to try and steal the power and that's what you're doing this entire time is like hunting down all of her children and murdering them. So you can get the pieces of the Elden Ring back to put it back together. And like restore order to this place. We unlocked this. We still have one tower left. I'm going to guess it's probably inside that building someplace. Let's go uppy, uppy, uppy. Uppy, uppy. It's dark. I don't like it. Maybe we're reading into a bad copy of Lord of the Rings. Excuse me? Are we going to knock on right now? Seems like it's going at a very rapid rate and it's going very high.
too high up. I want to go home. What the hell? Where am I? <gasps> you know where I think we are? We're about to go find Alexander. My best friend. I know I say that about every NPC, but he really is. I have to say there are some fantastic videos on YouTube which sum up the story really well. Out to Alexander. Oh, God. This is what we actually started out trying to find, like, two and a half hours ago when the stream first started. <laughs> and we finally somehow, in a roundabout way, found out how to get here. Oh, no. Stop it, you big meanie. Why are we even doing this? Why don't we just like run? Yeah, I think I think that's I think that's Look how much damage we did with one hit though. Holy shit. This guy's dead. Fall down. Fall down. Fall down. Trip. Trip. Fall. Trip. Eh, hey, you're an idiot. Just ram your sword up his butt. Yeah, that's it. That's the way. Spiked Palisade Shield? That looks badass, but I'll never use it. Whoa! Holy sh... An arrow in the back from him would probably kill you. I would assume it probably would. Which is why that just scared the shit out of me when he shot one at me. You're the only thing standing between me and my best friend Alexander. Um, this guy seems to take a lot more damage than the other one did. Trip and fall. Trip and fall. I don't think you could hit me from here. Thank you. Alexander, I'm coming. Wait for me. And I will call this definitely progress because this is like the main thing we set out to do tonight. I didn't even know we were going to do it. Look at the man and his. I don't think that's Alexander. He looks about a hundred times bigger than Alexander was. Hello? You Alexander? Are you my mama? You can now see the Knight of the Great Jar's red summon sign. I did it. Giant friend. Lord ahead. Alexander's daddy? I think it might be. That guy's massive. Yeah, I can see inside him. That's interesting. There's actually something modeled inside of him. That's all this was? Are you kidding me? I thought this was like a coliseum. Look, when you look at it on the map, it looks like it's a massive building. Guess that's all there was. Interesting. Whoa, look at that rock. What's the point of this? Are you Alexander's daddy? Oh, we found it. We set out we did what we set out to do. I'm not entirely sure what the purpose of this was. Apparently now I have his summon sign, whatever the hell that means. He gives you a quest. Interact with the NPC and three marks of invasion will appear that you must defeat to continue the quest. They're on your map now. I interacted with him. It didn't do anything. It just said you have now activated or you now have access to the great Jar Knight summoning sign. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I was supposed to come here later. I don't know. I'm thoroughly confused. Uh, 
Oh. Night of the Great Jar. Ah, don't do that. I did the great jar in my butt. Oh, no, no, not my butt. Not my butt, not my butt. Not my butt. My butt. No, no, not like this. Unfair, unfair, unfair. Holy shit. He's brutal. <laughs> He's ruthless. He was dicing my dead body into pieces. I just lost 14,000 runes. So you kill these three guys and then something happens. Uh, he's rough and there are three of them. Yeah, I was going to try and summon one of the other two and see if they're just as hard. And if they are, we might just have to come back later. I still kind of want to go down to the underground area and see what happens when we light all eight of those torches. If we haven't already. Oh, shit. I didn't think these guys would be back. Kind of assumed you were like a one time kill. You wouldn't come back. I don't think they move though, so I think if we just kill this one, we should be good. You ass. You uncultured swine. Fall, 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 fall. Fall down. No, oh, not my 14,000 runes. Okay, maybe we don't fight you. Maybe we just go pick the runes up. Thank you. Nope, not doing that. That would be terrifying if they followed you. I can agree. Don't insult big things trying to kill you. Well, he was a big dumb dummy. He deserved it. I don't know if it's really worth our time to try these three again, unless we're actually determined to kill them all right now. Maybe it's better... Maybe our time is better spent getting our runes and then going back and lighting the last towers in that underground area and see what happens there. Which one did we summon last time? This guy? Do they all look the same? One has a hammer, so he probably doesn't use magic, but that's a long-reaching hammer. And one has also a long-reaching weapon. Holy crap, dude. These guys mean business. Try this one. Come on. I was hoping I could get a cheap shot off. It's a she. It's a she knight. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, I think we're going to come back and do this later. Wow. It's like three boss fights back to back. That's insane. Wow, yeah. There was no way that was happening. Oh, we gotta live through here long enough to get our runes back. That's crazy, man. Why did I wish this upon myself? I don't know why I wanted this. Thought it was Alexander. I didn't know it was Big Pot Man that was gonna kill me. Please don't. Please don't. We're all friends here. Thank you. 
Okay. I'm hoping I can go get my runes and then just teleport out, but I'm going to guess it's not going to let me because these guys will still be aggroed on me. Oh my gosh. Why? <laughs> that was so many runes. I was like 18,000 runes we just lost. That sucks. Well, we're just going to leave. See ya. Was nice knowing you. That sucks bad. Yeah, it really does. That was a lot of runes. That was like close to another level. I was trying to be a smart ass and just sprint through everything thinking, oh, there's no way they'll hit me. I'm running so fast. How he didn't kill me the first time I did that, I have no idea. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, no, Kron. I will find you, no, Kron. One of these days, I will find you. That's really high up here. Runes today, gone tomorrow. Isn't that always how it works? Um, I think we're one tower short if my count is correct, so we gotta figure out where this tower is. See ya. I would have liked to have killed him, but too late. Gotta keep moving. Oh, that's one of the ones I already lit. The only place I can think of where the last one would be is over here. There's a gold seed, we'll be able to add another flask to our flask count. Whee! Glorious, glorious day. Precious item ahead? Yeah, I already got it, dummy. Aren't you watching? <laughs> Stupid. No item ahead? Oh. No. The point of this area. Like a dead end. I had to try it because it would have been the one time that someone said there wasn't a secret wall and there actually was and I would have actually laughed hysterically. What was the point of this? There's nothing over here. Well, this apparently is not where the missing tower is that we still have to light. Where is it? A rune arc. I still don't know what those do. We've got like three of them tonight. Hidden path ahead. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Always liar, liar, pants on fire. Why don't we teleport back to the beginning? And count the towers and see how many we're missing. missing the very first one. <laughs> How? Where is it? Posture check? Oh no. Ugh. I can feel myself sinking further and further into the ground. How are we missing the first freaking tower? Over here somewhere. Yep. Nope. I lied. It's not. What's behind us? Oh, Mr. Crab. Hello, Mr. Krabs. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. Get out of here. Mr. Krabs. Posture is important. It is. It is. I'm not lying.
I hate how anytime you teleport, it shuts your lantern off. Oh, hello. We seem to be in a, uh, a little bit of a predicament here, you and I. Yeah, you son of a bitch. Here's the first tower. That's the elevator that brought us down here. Is it back where the crab came from? His little alcove? Not up there. Far west side of the island? That's after Elden Ring, Bubby? Uh, probably Xenoblade. So I've been wanting to play it, and actually I've been wanting to play it now because it's new now i didn't really want to have to wait like several months after it came out to play it there it is but elden ring's taking like three years for us to beat so i don't really want to play 200 hour rpgs at the same time so i'm waiting until i beat this first be still hey that's not fair Supposed to stay still and let me kill you. I paid good money for this game. Supposed to just win automatically. The $70 entrance fee paid for is like easiness. And I have like $80 credit. Um, they're scared. Poor little bars. I have like $80 uh, credit on Steam and I keep looking at Steam like every day. Like I just browse the store being like, what new game do I want? Like there's not a single game I'm even slightly appeals to me currently. So we'll just keep that credit in the back pocket until a new game comes out at some point that I want to play. I have been wanting to try and we probably will at some point even while we're still playing uh, Elden Ring. I've been wanting to try that Rumbleverse game on uh, Epic Game Store. At least this isn't an EA game. Every upgrade would cost you real money. I'm not lying. He's glowing. We unlocked the right to have a new boss fight, apparently. <laughs> oh, joy of joys. I unlocked another boss fight. Because I don't have enough. What do I do? Raise the corpse. What do I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, that's what I'm supposed to do. <clears throat> Touch the beast. Yeah, got it. Oh, what do you know? It's another boss fight. You would have guessed that. Not in a million years. Nope. <clears throat> it's like all this game has is just boss fights. That's it. The whole game. Oh, he looks so sweet, though. I don't want to fight him. Look at him. He looks like Bambi. Oh, he actually does look pretty cool. Oh, probably shouldn't scratch my face right as the boss fight starts. It's pretty cool, man. I like the music, too. It's like really somber music. Oh, this guy's dead, dude. <laughs> like, this guy's so dead. <laughs> Don't walk in that, probably, would be my guess. Okay, if we could hit him, he's dead. Like, as soon as we get, get a hit off. He's, he's, uh, he's hurting. Soon as we hit him. Any day now. Okay. <laughs> okay. Any day now. He actually seems too easy. Like, I almost feel like this is some sort of part of the storyline about, like, oh, this ancestor spirit was, like, once a super mighty beast, but, like, he's so old and decrepit now. And we're, like, here to put him out of his misery or something.
Ooh, he's got like ripped flesh on his mouth. All right, all right, all right. I'm getting too cocky. We've got him. Like, there's no way he beats us. Just putting that out there. How do I keep getting hit by that stuff? Noob. I'm a noob. There we go. And one more hit and he's dead. No! Hey, two more hits and he's dead. I'm really fighting the desire right now to just run up and smack him. <laughs> We're gonna do it. <laughs> oh, nice. A first try boss fight always feels really good. Ancestor spirit achievement unlocked. That was a good one. Isn't that Harry Potter's Patronus? They put Death Stranding on Game Pass? They did, yeah, and it's the Director's Edition, which I haven't even played that one yet. The Director's Cut. Good job, thank you. Although, the rare easy boss fights in this game, like, just don't feel, just don't feel the same. Like, you can tell when it's an easy one, and maybe that one's not easy for everybody. Maybe I just read the patterns really quick. Didn't expect beautiful and then regret. That's kind of how I feel, honestly. Like, something about that boss fight seemed really somber and sad. Well, we've done everything we can do down here now. So let's go talk to Saluvus. Oh, you can keep fighting him? Huh. No, 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 I didn't mean to do it. Oh, I meant to read the message. Oh, I guess you can't keep fighting him. Oh, okay. Huh. Weird. Or do I have to fight him again? I don't know. I'm confused. Likely skeleton? Why is that gold? I guess it's because it's highly appraised. Do I have to fight him again? How do I get out? I'm trapped! <laughs> I broke the game! Touched the dead guy too many times. How the heck do I get out of here? Oh. Why does it give you the option to touch him again? It seems weird to me. Oh well. So that's some progress tonight anyway. We beat whatever the hell this was. Hollow Horn Grounds. Now we gotta go talk to Saluvis, see what he has to say. Maybe now that we killed it, we can go talk to Blade. Maybe he'll have something new to say. Are there any new games out that you've been looking at, Ralliser, or that you're planning on playing? Or any games coming out? I even looked at, like, the upcoming releases list on Steam, and, like, there are no games coming out anytime soon that I'm even vaguely interested in. Rumbleverse on Epic Game Store looks fun, and it's free to play, so I've been wanting to try it. I'm not a huge Battle Royale game, but it doesn't really look like the typical Battle Royale. And if we reach a dead end? Tell us where he gives a straight answer. Just go talk to Celavus. Why can I not open my map? Look how quickly we got our 18,000, uh, 14,000 runes back. Why can't I open my- oh, hi. That's why I can't open my app. 
There we go. Still can't open it? Oh, this guy's aggroed on us. Come on. It was going to be Sons of the Forest, but I got delayed again until next year. I never played the original Forest. Looked interesting, and it has a VR mode on it. That's the only reason I really wanted to play it, because, again, it's one of those survival games. Same as the Conan game. Although, I'll admit, Conan is definitely... From what I've read and what I've understood about the Conan game, it's, like, much deeper than your typical survival game. It's almost like an MMO. How do I... There we go. <laughs> I was like, how the heck do I get out? But the forest is so good. I've watched a couple of streams of it. Nate's streams. Why are you still here? You said you were going to go find the gold mask. Go. I want to do that quest. Ah, well then. May the golden order shine. Ah. Nobody has anything left to say to me. They're all, they're all just flabbergasted at my presence. How do I only have two spirits, by the way? Like 40 hours into the game. Mm, we don't have the right stone still. Oh. Uh, it's all right, bud. We're still friends. Story in the forest is so good. I didn't even know I had a story. I assume that about a lot of games, apparently. <laughs> I assume a lot of games just have no story. Might even uh, go play some of the old uh, Dark Souls games after this. Because I've actually been surprised how much I've enjoyed playing this game. Journey to the capital. Morgoth the Grace given is Lord of Landell, the capital city. It lies at the foot of the Erd Tree, in the east of the Altus Plateau. But the two fingers forbid us from venturing there. <laughs> Until now. We required enough great runes to repair the Elden Ring. Praetor Rikard is the lord of the volcano manor on Mount Gelmir. He is a ruthless justicier who commands a justicier. visitors. Reviled oh, the forest has a very cohesive story? The volcano, Mount Gelmir, lies in the west of the Altus Plateau. I know it's something about like you're looking for your son who got kidnapped or something, right? The most appalling battle in the entirety of the shattering. Rikard has committed the grave sin of blasphemy. Marking himself as an enemy never to be forgiven. Well, that sucks. The Academy of Rhea Lucaria lies to Limgraves. Renala is queen of the Carian Lord, and her great rune dwells within. General Radan, the famed Red Lion. He fought Melania and her rot to a stance, and by my reckoning, Radan remains. Oh, I doubt he much resembled. He's in Kaled. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Um. Why do we come here? Saluvis so isn't here. Saluvis so is in this tower. Look how much of the map we've uncovered, though. You're trying to find your son and have to make some choices. Oh. Oh. Some choices. Oh. Fancy. <clears throat> so I will admit... Oh, we still haven't fought that dragon yet either. Stop, man. You're wolves. How, how would you possibly kill me? 
Um, I will admit to having spoiled a little bit of the game to myself to the point where I know as of right now. Well, actually, the only thing I've spoiled is how to fight Radon. And as of right now, I think there's three branching quest lines we can do to fight Radon. We can either go back to his red main castle and kill the two bosses at the same time that we fought last time. And if you kill them, it gains you entrance to Radon, I believe. And then if you do Ronnie's quest line, you can use that to get to Radon. And then like if you do Alexander's quest line, you can use that to get to Radon. And that's kind of what I'm trying to do is just figure out how to do any of those quest lines so we can fight him. I don't want to fight you, but I'm kind of tempted now that the fight started. Oh shit, maybe not. And by kind of tempted, I mean like, see ya, bye. Sorry I disturbed your slumber. Please leave me alone. Let's let bygones be bygones and pretend this never happened. He's not de aggroing. <laughs> I might be screwed. Well, I went to the wrong tower. Because technically, we don't even need to be doing any of the stuff I'm doing right now to forward the game, to my understanding. Like, everything I'm doing right now is just to get to Radon. And, like, if I decide to skip Radon, I could just be doing other things right now and, like, moving the game forward. But we also got stuck on that path earlier, which is why we kind of, like, sidetracked over this way. Because we were trying to find out how to progress the story and we got lost, couldn't figure out what we needed to do next. So I came over and started fooling with this ah, stuff. so you made Nefemi drink the potion. Well done. You are a touch more useful than I had thought. Very well. Then you shall have your gift. Knowledge of the sorcerous arts and of the tutelage of the great preceptor Celeris. I doubt much of it will lay within the grasp of a mere tarnished... But I'm a dummy, I don't do magic. Put your mind to it. Perhaps you won't embarrass our lady. You wish to begin right there? Well, your impatience, though boorish, is... <laughs> He's such a dick. Let's have at it. So, you had Nefeli drink the potion? He's like, so everybody in the round table holds dead then, right? Hmm. Right? <laughs> then perhaps something was amiss with Oh, so something was definitely supposed to happen. ...from the finest ingredients, but perhaps I should review the recipe. I may have expected too much of her to begin with. Well, well. You're asking me about that, are you? The task was left to you and the mongrel, was it not? Not only are you incompetent, but Shim's <clears throat> Look, man, I'll cut you down where you stand. Helping it. Now's as good a time as any. I'll let you in on it. There's a glintstone sorcerer by the name of Selen in Limgrave. We've met her. She owes me for the help I gave her when she was expelled from the academy. I asked her to look into the matter some time ago. I'll write you a letter of introduction. Go well, that's easy enough. We should have a teleport that goes right to her. Wait, while I'm here, I just want to see what he has. Man, they weren't lying. I read something like a beginner's guide to Elden Ring a while back, like beginner's tips and tricks before you play the game. Like somebody definitely said, like the easiest mode of this game is to be a magic caster. They were like, you can literally get your magic to the point where you can one hit kill all of the bosses of the game. And after what I've seen, I don't doubt that one bit. Yeah. We might have been able to shortcut this quest line now because we have, like, we've already explored all of this shit in the past that it's telling us to go look for. There you are. Shall we commence the lesson? No, I have a letter. Well, well. Celebus is not a name I ever wanted to hear again. But fine, if it will help you, my apprentice, I offer my knowledge. The stars alter the fate of the Carian royal family. 
and the fate of your mistress, Ralnik. But long ago, General Radan challenged the swirling constellations, and in a crushing victory, arrested their cycles. Now he is the force that repulses the stars. If General Radan were to die, the stars would resume their movement, and so too would Rani's destiny. I got nothing. I got nothing from that. <laughs> that told me absolutely nothing. So the stars aren't rotating. So does that mean that like right now time is standing still in the game? Like, is that part of what's happening in this world that we're in? Like, there is no death. Like, nobody dies because time doesn't pass. Or at least natural death. Like, people could still die by the sword and stuff, but, like, no one can naturally die. They're all just, like, in a epic fight of gods forever because time's standing still. Now who do I go talk to? Se uh... Celibus? Or... Blathe? We have 14,000 runes. I really need to make sure, like, I don't get too cocky and die. Which is why I ran when the <laughs> dragon started fighting me, because I realized, like, oh shit. We might die here. We might not be able to get these runes back. What about you, Mr. Board Games? Any new games coming out anytime soon that you're interested in? Anything that's caught your eye? Begging for another lesson so soon. Ugh, that remains much. I guess we gotta go talk to Blade then. Nope, I'm behind on games. Don't need to play Cult of the Lamb. Man, I'll tell you what. I have, like, the world's longest backlog. I have a real bad habit of anytime there's summer or winter or any season sales on Steam of just buying games. And, like, I play, like, five a year. So, like, at the rate I buy them, I'll never catch up. I've heard Cult of the Lamb was actually a pretty big disappointment to a lot of people because I guess the game itself only takes like five hours to beat and then it's over. It's not like as much of a roguelike as they made it out to be when it first got like advertised. So apparently after you beat it that first time five hours in like it's done. Like there's really no reason to go and replay it or anything. Might be a really bad idea. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Don't say anything. You gotta fight. <laughs> I don't know if you can get killed while you're talking to NPCs, but I would not put it past this particular game to do that. Is that all? Yeah, that's what I've heard, is it's not very long at all. I heard the same, but I'm hoping they expand on it. I really like roguelike games. I do too. Ah. Well met. What news? Hmm. You son of a bitch. Face, as soon as I start the conversation, he's like, get him! <laughs> Hurry, 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 hurry. I heard that you can fight Radon himself. He who was once called the strongest of all the demigods. Maybe it's just a coincidence, but I think it's worth investigating. I'll be on my way to this festival of Radon then. Okay, thank you. Bye. God, talk all day. Why don't you? He didn't even care. He didn't even care that there were clearly enemies coming to kill me. So yeah, at least Ronnie's... Oh, I thought he was going to kill him. At least Ronnie is unable to die of old age, or at least she's, like, stuck in time from the sounds of things of what Blade just said. The star scourge Radon is keeping the stars from turning. You're coming too, right? I'll meet you at Redmain Castle in Caelid. The way ahead is pleasingly simple. We fight, 
sword and fang. Me and you. <laughs> blades and mini blades. <laughs> I love it. And now I can just teleport to... The main castle. Still playing Far Cry 6. In the same way, I have 850 games in my Steam library and probably only played 50 of them. Summer and winter sales kill me. Still on Far Cry 5, 6 is in my backlog. Hey, nice, how's it going? So I think we just now unlocked the ability to do... That scared the shit out of me. I think that means we unlocked the ability to do the Radon fight now from the sounds of things. Yeah, because there's no enemies here now. Nobody's fighting me. Good, how are you? I'm doing all right. We got really sidetracked tonight and don't really know what we're supposed to be doing to progress the game, so... We started following all these quest lines, and I think we finally just finished Ronnie's quest line. And uh, Blade just invited us to join the festivities at Red Main Castle. Except the door is still closed. What the heck? Need the right side of the medallion to progress? Oh, the main story, you mean? Yeah. You did just say, like, meet me at Red Main Castle, right? I'm not crazy. We're dead. Hey, there's an item down there. I could have sworn I, hit, I heard like cheering in the background as we were walking around. Teleport in with the grace. Well, now I need to go get my runes first, because that was like 15,000 runes we just dropped. Yeah, you can hear cheering. Like, I hear cheering out of my right headphone right now. Or yelling. Whatever it is. Break all this shit. Let's get off the horse, because I think that's part of the problem here. Get the runes back, and then we'll teleport in. So, however, we were originally supposed to get into Red Main Castle, I must have messed it up, because we've never once been able to get that gate open. Unless that wasn't ever the way you were intended to do it. First off, wolf and then warrior. Oh, this is where those two bosses were. So we don't have to fight them now. And Halo is starting in the background. Blaze, you never struck me as someone who likes to play Halo. Champions, welcome. The stars have aligned. The festival. Who are these guys? General Radon, mighty demigod of the shattering, awaits you. Champions, prepare for. And to you. Thank you. He's not listening. He's like, come roast marshmallows with me. The Radon Festival! Ah, there you are. <laughs> it's my daddy! The plays are all made up. I'm Mini Blaze! Let's give them a remember, I don't know why that makes me laugh. I love the chanting in the background. It really does remind me of Halo. 
Let's see what you're made of. Into the fray to keep. <laughs> what are these other white ghosts? Are these people I was supposed to find and I haven't met yet? It's a samurai. <gasps> Alexander! Ah, you came. How delightful. Indeed, I thought I might find you here. By the by, do you know for whom this festival is being held? Me. Well, it is none other than General Radan himself. We found him a long time ago, and he was like down in a, a tunnel. Of the shattering, a demigod in the flesh. Oh God! In truth, I quiver at the thought. Such is his frightful repute. But the fear simply assures me the ordeal is worth undertaking be sure to get a good vantage my friend i iron fist alexander do hereby vow to unflinchingly <laughs> brave this ordeal nice. but like we found him in a tunnel earlier in the game like randomly stumbled on him and he was in a like outside the entrance to a cave under the ground and he said if only i could find a way to open this door i could i could go to the festival of radon at Red Main Castle, and we never did figure out how to open that door. Sure to get so I think there's just multiple, like I was saying earlier, I think there's just multiple quest lines you can take to get you to this exact same spot here. I'm glad we chose the Ronnie one, though, because I think it was, it was definitely the cooler quest line that I could see. I mean, the ones that we found. Who knows how many there are that we didn't even find. Champion, are you ready? Who are you? Dead. Good and prepared, young chum. The festival begins. I see. When you are ready, come to me again. Very, uh... They're really building this up. Old here again. Hmm. Kind of don't want to fight a boss right now because I have like 15,000 runes. I don't want to lose them. Erdogan makes me laugh. He is goofy looking. Are you good and prepared? The festival. But we could just beat him on the first try, right? Like we did with the last boss we fought. The last two bosses, by the way. Two bosses we fought tonight. First I try wins. Paint you the full picture. Ooh, we're having story time. General Radon is cursed ever to wander. Does he have arrows in his back? Spears? Eaten from the inside God. by Melania's scarlet rot. His wits are long gone. Yeah, because he had a war against Melania. He lost and he got kicked out into Kaelid. Now he gathers the corpses of folks alike, gorging on them like a dog. Did he just crush that horse to death? Like <laughs> howling at the sky. The horse looked like it was brittle bones. We must make merry. Make merry. Gathering of champions. The revels begin. The celebration of Bat Radon just crushed his horse. The Radon Festival. Oh, we can't leave. I just realized that. Can we? Oh, we can. Okay. You will find the field of battle past the church ahead, upon the shore under the fort. General Radan is there, even now, divested of his wits, devouring corpses, and howling at the sky. So his... He's gone crazy because he's infested with the rot. You will find the field of General Radan divested and howling. Hmm. 
I was actually considering skipping this boss fight since it's not necessary to proceed the game, but since we're here... The door's open now. Stone six. I need a seven. Seek faith and then seek victory. So, like, this is the most epic buildup they've made for a boss fight yet. Need to defeat him for Ronnie's quest line. Gotcha. Visions of death. Visions of death danced in their heads. You get his armor, it's nearly the strongest armor in the game. Nice. Is there a grace? No. Where's the teleporter take you to? So many questions. Oh, the teleporter must take you to the fight. Gotcha. And you just cross. <laughs> uh, I don't know why that happens. Be sure to res your friends in battle. I don't know why that's a thing. <laughs> Seems like the beach is right there. Why can't I just walk across? No. Why do they look like Christmas trees? Christmas trees over there. <laughs> Probably try this fight once, but I'm already streaming way later than I planned to stream tonight. I just want to see him. Oh, you can use your horse. Sweet. Ooh, what the fuck? Oh my god. Holy shit. I'm gonna die before I even get a chance to look at this guy. I'm trying to use all of these. Oh, I just wasted one. I'm trying to press all these buttons. Oh my! Lionel the Lion Hearted? Oh god! Horrible. Come on, summon, summon, summon! There we go. Who is that? Oh, that was Blave! Yeah, Blave! Verdon's spear? Ooh! Who's that? Ah, oh, Alexander! Come, Alexander. We fight. Oh, he's up there fighting people already. Holy shit. I'm just trying to make sure I pick up all these items. He's massive! Patches? <laughs> Why is Patches here? Are those all of them? They're, they almost have him. I mean, he's not dead, but look, he's already like so low. How do I... You said I can summon him? I can... I can, uh, resurrect him? Oh my god, like one hit kills all of them. How do I res him? Oh, get out of there! You son. Go, 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 go. Alexander died. Catches instantly goes back into his world the first second. You can res them. I didn't even notice that. Patches is a backstabbing traitor. Oh, wow. Play this down. That's fine. We'll take him on ourself. We'll take him on ourself. Oh, my God. First fight is already below half health. Like, bring him back. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? 
was that? What was that? He was a meteor. We're dead. Oh my god, he chased us. Oh, I don't like this. Where's Alexander? Is that him? No, oh, that's Blaze. Where's Alexander summon? Oh, it's over there. What the hell is happening? <laughs> oh, we're doing so good, though. Don't die, don't die. Summon. Got him. He comes in like a meteor. <laughs> he really did, like literally. Oh, all my guys are dying again. We're doing so good, though. Look how much his health's gone down. Wow, dude. So, like, if you summon all those people, like, it makes the fight, like, a hundred times easier, huh? That's a cool fight. It's a really cool fight, except we just lost 15,000 runes. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what the likelihood of us getting those back are. Try it one more time. I'm, I'm surprised we got as close to killing them as we did. They help a lot. Not a bad fight. You get the sword after his fight if you use the remembrance. Gotcha. We haven't done that yet. Sprint, just sprint, just sprint. Just sprint, just sprint, just sprint. Oh, we're learning, we're learning. Sprint, just sprint. Somebody get up there and start fighting him so he stops launching arrows at me. <laughs> Blaze. What the fuck? Oh my god, what the fuck? We're dead, we're dead, we're dead. We're dead, we're gonna lose 15,000 runes. Oh my god. Where are my runes? Oh, we never got the Finger Maiden last time. Oh, my horse is dead. That can't be good. <laughs> that can't be good. Who's this one? Ah, oh, there he is. My man. Where's my runes, man? Where are they? Where are my runes? 15,000 runes. Please. Where are they? You passed them? Oh, okay. Just keep moving is the key? Gotcha. We did so good the first try. Like, he was not close to dead necessarily, but definitely below half. So how do you res him? that attack yo, yo 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 get up oh my gosh man i'll try one more time but then i gotta stop like if i keep going i'll just never stop oh man this is a crazy fight imagine imagine what kind of what kind of bragging rights i would have had if i killed redon on the first try can't even imagine it hold on if we're gonna do this we gotta do it right All right. What kind of bragging rights I would have had. I would have been screaming it from the mountaintops to all of the gamers I know. Be like, hey, how many times did Radon take you? Oh, really? Oh, I killed him on the first try. You have some remembrances. I think you will get some good weapons from them. Shit, I can't read chat right now. Ooh, mommy. Uh, I was versus this boss. My heart rate got to 170. I lost, beat him three times in a row. He had one millimeter of health. 
It's so stressful. <laughs> it seems like a stressful fight. On the purple ball attack, I found it best to jump as they come in. Oh, on horseback or were you on foot? Did we get all the summons here? No, we did not. Look at them running. It's such a long distance. They're like, oh my god, we have to run three miles before we even get to this guy. Hey, there's an item over here. What the heck? Radon spear. I wonder what these Radon spears do, because we pick up like five of them in the process of this fight. Got two more summons. Where am I? They're there. Then the Finger Maiden's, like, up here somewhere, isn't she? Finger Maiden Therolina. Who's this one? I think we've ever gotten this one. Oh, no. I guess we already did. All right, well, I guess we should actually get into the fight now. Hello. Thanks for joining. Action's returned to his world. He doesn't even die. I get what you're saying. He doesn't even die first. He just disappears. He's like, forget this. I'm not going to be a part of this. That was dumb for me to, like, just charge right in there. We never said we were intelligent. Man. This fight, man. So giant, he actually scares me. I beat Radon on my first try. Did you really? Holy shit. Intimidating boy on horse. I beat Radon by spamming Dragon Rot. Dragon Rot makes it way easier. At that point, you literally run away while it kills him. What's Dragon Rot? How do I get that? One more try. Gosh, that first try is like the best we've done so far. We had him down to like a quarter health. What is Dragon Rot? Weird. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh my god. Hmm. Oh man. Okay. Zigzag, zigzag. Oh my gosh. It gets so close to killing me. I'm in blade. Oh, that's getting close. That's getting close. Oh, guys, get out of the way. <laughs> Giant swords are falling from the sky. Thank you. I feel like maybe I should start fighting before I summon these other two. Because you got to go so far past them to summon these last two. I don't even know if they do anything. I assume Blaze and uh, Alexander probably do most of the work. It's one of the dragon churches. It's at one of the dragon churches. At the Cathedral of Dragon Communion in Kalidia in South. Costs one dragon heart to get. Oh, I have a dragon heart. I've never used it. Oh, you can't summon your summons? What the heck? You can get, like, 20 other people to help you, but you can't summon your summons. <laughs> hmm. We gotta stop running into that. Oh, he was stunned, and we didn't even take advantage of it. Oh, Blade's still with me. Come on, Blade. How do you, how do you, uh... You guys said that you can resurrect him, right? Oh, God! <laughs> Go! <laughs> Castle and Jaren. That's the first time we summoned that one. Oh, man. Just don't want to get in there. I know we got to. Oh man, he's so far. He's so low. Just waiting for him to cast these blue balls at me so I can run. Oh my gosh. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Want to summon some more people? 
Come on, come on, come on. Give me a summon, give me a, give me a summon, give me a summon. There we go. Oh, man. Tax a punch. Okay, distract him. Distract him. Summons. <laughs> Please. Bad timing, bad timing. Get away. Holy shit. Get in there. Get in there. I can't see. I'm not locked on. I'm not locked on. Come on. Stupid camera, man. The camera causes so many problems. Ah, oh, this is bad. This is bad. Get out of there. Come on. Heal, 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 heal. Oh, come on. Come on. We got him. Yes. We got him. Gosh, three attempts? Three attempts? You kidding me? Nice. Who did the last hit? Not me. <laughs> I can tell you for sure it wasn't me. It was probably Blave. That's a cool fight. I'm very hyped that it only took us three attempts to kill him. Or four, technically stars all started moving again and i'm like amped like i'm shaking the heck gg indeed guys gosh dang use the remembrance at the round table his sword is so strong oh i just used so many freaking level ups to level this sword again a red mark was made on the map. Why? Where? See a red mark on the map? Man, that was cool. I'm glad we beat him tonight. Ah, good. Now we're waiting for you. It's my daddy. What a sick way to fight it. The glory of the clash is shared by Radan and you. And ha, did you see that afterwards? A falling star right before our eyes. Oh, that's what the bright the white flash was. was. Holding back something at that scale. He was a living legend if ever I saw one. And the path has now been cleared. Oh, he was holding back a meteor. Rani's face or a falling star. Let's meet where the falling star bit the earth. Nice, and then we can go to Nakran. For Mistress Ronnie. Mistress Ronnie indeed, my friend. Red Mark isn't in Limgrave. The cutscene you had the start hit the world because you defeated Radon. Radon was holding back the stars. Oh. So Radon got pissed off because he lost to Melania. And he like became mentally like depraved or something, like started going crazy. Let's meet where the fallen sun will go into battle. My only purpose is to fight for Rani's fate. The curtains rising. All right, I think this is where we're gonna call it for tonight, guys. Man, I'm excited. I didn't think we were gonna kill him. I just wanted to see the fight. I had no idea we were actually gonna beat it. That's awesome. But for now, we killed two mini bosses on the first try tonight, and then we killed Radon in four tries. Man, that feels good. That makes you feel good. All right, thanks for joining, though, guys. I'm really enjoying this game, man. These boss fights are crazy. I loved how he was like super fat and his horse was super skinny and he crushed him. I don't know. Something about this fight was ridiculous. When are you going to stream next? Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow night, 8 p.m. Central. So hopefully I'll see you guys there. Thanks for joining. I'm having a really good time. He is half horse. Um, For now, that's it, guys. Thanks for being here. Man, I'm still amped. Like my whole body's shaking. Super amped up from beating that guy. Thanks for being here. I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night. Catch you later.